Oh, hello. Oh my god, sorry. I'm like dying of a coughing attack right now. Hi, Elle. Hi, Raylene. How are you guys? It is midweek. Oh my god, are you joking? I literally timed this so I would not get an ad on YouTube with this little mix. Okay, we're good. We're over it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I hope you guys' this week is going well so far. It was a pretty chill day for me. I, um, what did I do? What did I do yesterday? You got home just in time. Where were you? What the heck? I, um, I went for a walk today. Um, like I told you, Raylene, I'm doing like, I'm going to try and do my daily walks on my lunch break at work because I don't want to, you know, spend my off work time to go for a walk. My do actually, I wanted to like, walk before I got up for work like I work at 7 a.m. so I was like oh if I get up at like 6 15 I could go for a walk before work but I'm not doing that I'm not a morning person f that I'm tired <laughs> I go to bed at like super late <clears throat> grocery car wash gas Ooh, I need to I say I need to go um like get my car washed but usually my mom does if she goes out and washes hers so mine just gets washed by proxy <laughs> Yes, yay for being healthy. We had like a whole discussion about it in my group work chat, like with my, uh, like just my team uh, of like three people. We're all talking about it. And I'm like, I used to be super good about it, but then I don't know, it's harder when you live at home and your parents just buy whatever. So, <clears throat> but yeah, um, my friend told me I'm kind of close to finishing this world. So I kind of want to finish it on stream today. You're progressing the story on FF14 on the new bun, yay! Right, the event comes out tomorrow. I'm excited. I've been trying to like cap my weekly tomes before then, and I'm almost there. I'll have to run a few roulettes tomorrow, but that's no big deal. So, but uh, but yeah, I want to beat the I, I want to beat this today. If we do end up beating it, uh, I do actually have over on my other screen. Um, the Honkai Star Rail YouTube channel actually has a whole playlist of all of the character trailers. So I have that up on the side and give or take, I would say it would take like less than 45 minutes to watch them all because they all average around a minute and a half, two minutes. So, and there is 22 videos. So let's just say 22 times two minutes, like 44 minutes. <clears throat> I want the pink goober mount too. I need to start drawing a bit more as well. I do want to go and redo my like VGen like profile picture and stuff because you're not actually allowed to have art that isn't yours. Like if you're if you're an artist on VGen, your profile picture can't be art that you have commissioned. Like it has to be like your banner and profile art have to be drawn by you. And I don't ever draw my like myself. <laughs> So I have like an old casual version that I was making panels for, for my, for like this Twitch channel before like I got my finalized design. So that's what's currently chilling there. So I'll have to like go in, make a new pro. I'm, I'm thinking of making one of those, like my little sketchy punk style one in, um, um, of me. So I think I'm going to do that sometime soon. So hopefully before the weekend, I don't know. I feel like I'm like so swamped, but I'm not. <laughs> But I'm going to jump right into the game because I have enough tickets to do the beginner warp or whatever. So we can start off with that. Let me just like move everything over. <gasps> oh, sorry. I got my tea too. I haven't had tea yet today. Let's just pause that. I keep forgetting how loud the Hawkeye Star Rail music is. It's so freaking loud. Oh, yeah, I'll give you guys the rundown of like what I've done. Oh, wait, Herda, what do you want? Give me a number, uh, one. I would have rather picked seven, but. Automatic reply, two. Automatic reply, two, two, two. I can't find a puppet. I'm locating the signal. What the fuck? Oh, I lost it. No wonder I can't find it. Uh, where did you lose it? Is this how you get your daily quests for the day? Like, <laughs> did your puppet fall off the space station? Where did you lose it? We can ask others to help. I lost connection to it. To it. Do you not get it? It's connected now. This is a group message. Give me the number of current curios. What? 
I told you not to reply. Oh, okay. I don't know what that was, but you have Dr. Pepper. Lucky. I do have a seven up in the fridge, but like, I don't know. I felt like I was doing well and I didn't want to, um, I didn't want to have it. Oh my God. And I'm so bothered right now because, um, I don't know what is in here. I don't know what is in here, but like, oh my God, did it fix itself? <gasps> did it fix itself? Oh my God, please tell me it fixed itself. Oh my goodness. Okay, yesterday that I was just doing like some dailies and like side quests and whatever. And that fucking exclamation point on this one would not go away. And like, there was nothing here that had an exclamation point on it on either tab. And it was like so bothering. In a way, yes, dailies, but also you get a side quest in it for text messages too. Okay. Like a mysterious Discord note of, yeah, exactly. But yeah, let me see if I can warp really quick. Or sorry, yeah. Ooh, we have 23 tickets now because we just accepted something. Okay. Let's see what we get. Sleepy, finally caught another stream. Hi, yes I am. I hope you're doing well too. I'm gonna try and finish this planet today, I think. Okay, please don't be a purple fucking light cone. Give me something like decent. Oh my god, it's a purple fucking light cone. Oh my god. Okay, it's fine. We're gonna summon one more time, so. Let's do it again. I still don't know the tell. I know you guys have told me the only tell I know is like this like light. Oh my goodness, guys. Oh my goodness, guys. Oh my goodness. 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 A light cone. Are you joking? Oh, wait. Who is this? Oh, at least it's a new character. I have the worst luck at this game. How did I pull? You know, I spent all my luck. I got sparkle in like three ten pulls, and that's where it all went. Oh, what is that? Now I have to go. I have to go see who this character is that we just got. Who are you? Oh, she's cute. What is she? Destruction? Actually, I really want to see. I'm not going to put this light cone on her, but what were the new ones I got? When the wearer uses basic attack skill or ultimate damage attack enemies, the wearer gains one stack of mischievous each stack. Of... Oh my god, that's like fucking sick. Actually. So I'm just gonna get rid of all these basic ones. I recently started playing like a couple weeks ago, but the tell for the five star is like a ticket goes kind of rainbow. Okay. I'm gonna look at that the next time we get one. What is this one? The hunt increases the wearer's crit damage by 30%. When the wearer's basic attack or skill does not result in a crit hit, increases their crit. Oh. That's probably for Dr. Ratio, right? I feel like I have a pretty like decent light cone on him right now actually <clears throat> especially since i leveled it up yeah after entering battle it increases the wearer's speed by eight percent and the damage by twelve percent when the wearer takes damage this effect will disappear Ooh, maybe i'll replace it yeah basically what i did from last time that i saw you guys is that i leveled them so they're level 40 now i leveled their light cones to like at least 30 um, I dumped some points, like, into all their traces that I could. I equipped them with some relics. Um, so yeah, like, hers is 30. She's all decked out. She's got new new gear that I got from, like, a... From, um... One of those vendors. And then, yeah, Sparkle as well. Her light cone. Um, I actually really like her light cone. It might be shitty, but, like, after entering battle, increases the attack of all allies by 8%. Like... So I'm hoping that's good. And yeah, I can't really progress on these because I don't have the stuff to upgrade it yet. But we also changed the team makeup. March is no longer on the team. She has been, she's been downgraded. And I have leveled Natasha to 40. I leveled her light cone because I thought it was pretty good. Increases the wearer's outgoing healing skill by 10%. So I thought like, perfect. Like if I ever get a healer, like this will be good. 
upgraded her traces and i also upgraded her relic that she's wearing right now because like it all has to do with like healing so i'm like this is fucking perfect and i went around and tried to like kill a couple, couple mods m mobs in the mines and i think i did a pretty good job so um yeah we're gonna do the main story so let's get up here and go it's getting late where to now? Yeah, I think my team is pretty. Like, I am sad that I have two like just like two physical types because Natasha is a physical type too. But uh, yeah, to what can you do? Um, it's a big customer with bigger not pockets. I need time, not money. Hi, sinful. Wait, what do you mean they got me? Careful. Who got me? How do you forget us? We literally came from a different planet. Why are you still strolling around the city? Do you know the Silver Main guards are looking all over for you? Are they though? Because they look like they're literally standing on these stairs when they're not turning my way. Don't get spotted. You're the one talking to me through a fucking door, girl. Like, let me inside. What the heck? safe here. My workshop has pretty good soundproofing, and barely anyone comes in. Just what crime did you commit exactly? They recalled a bunch of guards from the front line to track you down. It's unprecedented. Now they're patrolling the whole city and everyone's in a panic. I like how this girl doesn't suspect us at all either. Like, like, let's not question the military, like, that you've been in, that you work for in a city. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> Why did they pull you out? Like, is there, I don't know. I feel like I would not trust the people that are on the loose. <laughs> Wanted by the city. Oh, we just not yet, March. Oh yeah, she's about to spill the beans. Ranya said we could trust you completely. You mean to say you don't trust me completely? Good. That's smart of you. Hear me sipping. But you needn't worry. Picolia and I aren't even on speaking terms. It was her that ejected me from the architects. Okay, never mind. This makes sense now. <laughs> Why she, like, doesn't, like, not distrust us I right away. I don't believe you guys would do anything bad. And the architects are going to need conclusive and publicly available evidence for me to think otherwise. Besides, I know the architects, and if they did have any evidence, they would have released it by now. I know Kokolia's style. Get everyone into a frenzy first. Most people in a frenzy don't stop to ponder the details. Mm. I'll say, so what details have you been pondering? Me? None. What Kokolia and the architects get up to has nothing to do with me. My time is too precious for pondering. These days I just spend my time fixing things in this workshop and playing music. It's a pretty carefree existence. If I'm not careful, I'll start boring you all with sob stories from the past. Let's get back to you guys. If long lost Branya told you to come here, you must have something important to tell me. We have a letter. You can trust me. I know our paths have only crossed once before, but my intuition tells me you guys are good people. And I've got good intuition, by the way. <laughs> um. I'm gonna say we may as well tell the long and short of it from start to finish. It's gonna fade to black anyways. Oh, I'm the best let me, let me! Uh, that storyteller, or facts. she just has a big mouth? <laughs> yeah, telling Sir Will about your time in the underworld and le and what you know about the Stellaron and showing her Bronia's letter. So that's what's been happening. No wonder we hadn't heard from Bronia recently. <sighs> After all these years in isolation and without a single word from below, this is what's become of the underworld? I believe you. There's no way you could have invented all those twists and turns. What's more, we have Miss Zila here as living proof. As for the Stellaron, I know why Branya got you to find me. Why? I was still one of the architects working in the scientific research division. I was researching the Stellaron. 
I never thought I'd hear that word again after being expelled by the architects. Come on, I'll tell you everything. Hell yeah, that was easy. Only a very few people in Bellabog know of the existence of the Stellaron. Those that do would never associate it with the Fragmentum or Eternal Freeze. But according to the data recorded in that robot, Svara, the architects dug out the truth long ago. The research results were purposely hidden away to ensure that the outside world would never know of them. Just my luck. Out of all the research topics I could have chosen, I insisted on the Stellaron. It's clear now that anyone who wanted to get closer to the truth would have been expelled. I'm the surprised they didn't, like, brainwash her or, like, erase her memories if she knew, that, like, all about the Stellaron. Maybe I should be thanking Kakolia. All she did was push me out. She could have decided yeah, to take exactly. a more permanent measure. Mm, I actually kind of want to know this, so how much do you know about the Stellaron? I the Stellaron and the Fragmentum were linked, so I was already close to the truth. It's a shame that the Architects ejected me before I could discover that the source of the Fragmentum was the Stellaron itself. Before I lost my position, I was applying for permission to survey the Stellaron directly. It was my research topic, but I'd never even set eyes on it. My research was all based on historical data and lab simulations. Not long after I submitted my preliminary report and application, I received my punishment. It was obvious that somebody didn't want my research to continue. Uh, do you know what Kakolia's is? Kakolia. Angoli? What did it's I just say? It's been so many years since we last spoke. Angolia? We were great friends once. There was nothing we wouldn't share. She became a completely different person when she took on the Supreme Guardianship. The convictions she once held, her enthusiasm, it was like they were drawn out of her by some mysterious force. She gave the order to expel me herself and refused to see me. I never understood that behavior and I gave up trying to use logic to work it out a long time. Sometimes I even wonder whether she really so I'm drinking my tea. I just muted my mic so I could just gulp it Is down. That possible? <laughs> Perhaps there's a single guardian consciousness that gets handed down from generation to generation. And the real Kakolia no. has no. Yeah, that's basically me with my tea right now. <laughs> is she being compelled by previous generations of guardians to make such yes, she is. She's baffling possessed. decisions? Who knows? But this might make for good songwriting material. And can we talk to Japard? <laughs> Japard? Not a chance. He's a decent guy, but also famously uncompromising. For my brother, orders are more important than anything. Even if you stuck Branya's letter to his forehead, he wouldn't be swayed. You need to choose your words carefully if you want to persuade him of something. It might be best if I talk to him. Though, I'd need a strategy first. And do you know where the yes. Stellaron is? I oh, never shit. observed it directly, but Yay, I used does. lab simulations and outbound surveys to establish a rough location. According to the survey results, the Stellaron is likely to the north of Bellabog, somewhere in the vast snow plains. We must locate it as soon as possible, ideally before Kokolia takes action. Can you tell us the way? Not a problem. I was thinking the same thing. But I'm afraid telling you might not be enough. The area to the north of Bellabog has been more or less swallowed up by the Fragmentum. If you want to get to the northern snow plains, you'll need to get past the Silvermane Guard restricted zone on the front lines first. Even if you get past the restricted zone in one piece, you'll have a whole heap of Fragmentum to deal with. Mm. Silvermane yes. Guard Restricted Zone. That's where the main force of the Silvermane Guards is stationed. They've consolidated their position there in order to resist the encroaching Fragmentum. Sounds like the three of us and Zila might not be enough. Why don't we go back underground and get Wildfire to come with us? I fear we may not have the time. Hey, enough pessimism. Back in my official capacity days, I spent a lot of time in the North. I got to know the soldiers and officers on the front line very well. 
Hey Khan! Hello my fellow HSR degenerate. Bro, we just got shafted on, um, I'm gonna show you after. This calls for brainwaves, not brawn waves. How about I take you over myself? Really? Great! Phew. Less scary if someone you know is leading the way. <laughs> I want to see the Stellaron too, you know. It was my research topic for over a decade. You don't get that many decades in life. <sighs> That's settled then. There's no time to lose. We should head out as soon as you're ready. Okay, yes, but yes. Hi, hi, Khan, and hi, Ashen. Uh, no, worse. Okay, so we... Okay, so I pulled on that, that, like, beginner banner or whatever. Can you actually, like, see the options from here? So we pulled uh, two tenfolds on here. Can I, like, see all the, like, what I can possibly get? Okay, I was hoping there would be pictures. Okay. Um, yeah, I pulled twice on here. Didn't get anyone, if you were wondering. Um, we got a light cone. Which one did we get? Okay, we did get a gold star light cone. Uh, this one, I think. Sweet dreams. Increases the wearer's crit damage by 30% when the wearer's basic attack or skill does not result in a crit hit. Increases their crit rate by 36% for one turn. This effect can only trigger once every three turns. So, um, yeah, we got that. <laughs> Hi, Mel! Hello, hello! And I think we got another purple light cone. Shit, which one did we get? Oh, this one. This one right here. Um, so when the wearer uses a basic attack skill or ultimate to attack enemies, the wearer gains one stack of mischievous. Each stack increases the wearer's attack by 12%. So I don't think this one is that bad, actually, because, like... Yeah, I don't know. I feel like that's pretty alright. <laughs> and then we did get a, a person. Um, we got her. This four-star lady. So, she looks cool. I like her design. But she was not what I was hoping for. I didn't want one of those. <laughs> oh my god, is it? Am I just cursed by these? By Yang King? Is that it? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I was saying um, earlier, so my team makeup before was Dr. Ratio, the main character, Sparkle, and March. But we have abandoned March. I'm sorry. We love you, girl. But... I don't like your shields, and I'd rather have a healer, so I leveled up a uh, Natasha. And I think I have a really, like, good light cone for her, so, like, increases the wearer's outgoing healing by 10%. And I also have these, like, healing relics that I don't know where I got them from, but it increases her outgoing healing as well, so I was like, fuck it, we'll be stacked, like, I'm never gonna die. Yeah. Yeah, so... I think, I think we're pretty good. I've leveled everyone to like level 40, so like I literally cannot ascend anyone even. Like I'm fucking capped out right now, so I think we'll be good on the story. Hopefully. Um, where am I going? Head out with Serval. Oh. <gasps> Elsa Hydra! Hello, hello! Oh, who is it? <sighs> Darn it! I forgot my brother said he'd be around today. Oh my god, well, we're about to meet him, so... Find somewhere to hide, quick! I'll handle him. I'm pretty sure if we could talk to you through the door outside, he can definitely hear all of what is going on right now. <laughs> Japard! It's you! I didn't think you'd have the time to visit with things so tense on the front line. Oh my god, line. she's acting <laughs> sus, guys. Things are manageable. The latest wave of monster attacks has slowed. I'm back in the city to take care of a few matters, but I'll be back on the front line later. I thought I told you. Ah! Oh, yes. That's right. Sis, you look a bit She's pale. acting sus. She's gonna Did blow our cover, happen? guys. N no, why would anything have happened? You don't normally use my full name. Girl, what are you doing? You said you hate it when I call you bro in public. Well, okay. I agree. It sounds better. She's coming back around. She's covering. Full name. Right, Broseth? You can call me whatever you like. Look, Serval, I'm here on official business today. There's something wrong with the barrier generator device, and the engineers in our unit don't know how to fix it. She's I busy. She's gonna take us to the Stellar. Those guys can't think outside the box. Of course they can't wrap their heads around my design. <sighs> I thought it was something big. Leave it here. I'll take a look. 
Thieves, hello! Just set it on fire. Sorry to trouble you. Oh no, he's he's gonna say like, you need to come with me. Why are you being so polite? Oh, and why is the city under curfew all of a sudden? Has something happened? There's fugitives about, and we're here. I, I've been instructed to keep it quiet. Wow, bitch. Little Jeppy, so grown Little up Jeppy, now, I love down that. A Little sister. Jeppy. Don't say that. Ah, forget it. If I don't tell you, Palo will. Oh shit! No, thank you for the follow. Last night, Lady Bronya suddenly appeared. Bronya. She She's without possessed saying now. anything to anyone. The Supreme Guardian is worried that the three intruders may have followed Bronya out of the Fragmentum and back into the administrative district. What? She issued a curfew for the entire city and ordered us to pursue and capture any suspicious individuals. Shit, no one tell them we're here. Ah, so that's how it is. No wonder I haven't heard from Bronya. Is she alright? I'm not sure. She hasn't left Klopoth Fort. We're literally Supreme right Guardian there! Dude, he can just turn around and see no us! More. What? There's this huge pillar in the way, and none of us thought to all just line up single file behind it to block his LOS. Oh my goodness, what the heck. Girl, I'm livid. A song I had to be released on Spotify got delayed past the release date, so now that's been processed and good to go, I have to wait like another two weeks. No! What? What the fuck? That's so stupid! I didn't even know like it like took a long time for uh, uh like songs on there to get get like I thought you could just throw them on there. <laughs> also, hi Meta, Waifu Simulator Elite. Yeah, it is good. Only our polls are absolutely atrocious. So, but these these people are cool. I don't own them. Actually, no, I own the girl that's over here. But well, this girl. I was sure worried about her. After she disappeared, Pela's workload doubled. She said she barely had time to go out. She really They're does my tell team. you everything. Oh, by the way, I left my Goethe Hotel limited edition flask behind last time I was here. No, he's gonna look, look and see her. I think I left it over. Hey, I haven't spent any money on it, so. Wait. Girl, you are blowing our cover. What is it? You seem pretty off today, Serval. Don't you love her hair, though? Look, it's like a VR chat avatar with the missions. It's, um... Oh my god, guys. Right. How did he not hear her footsteps? You remember how you neglected all those flowers to death? I piled them all over there during a bit of spring oh cleaning, my god, and girl. now they smell terrible. So, don't go over there. Wait, girl, are you... L, what? You can, you know you can change your badge, right? It's like your chat identity, <laughs> but we, you can like click on it and change it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you were repping the founder's badge so you can fucking flex on everyone that comes in here. Seems like a strange reason not to take a look. Plus, am I supposed to believe you were spring cleaning? You must be up to more forbidden research. take your sister for never mind this is your space and i shouldn't intrude i've got business to take care of bye for now wait can you wear two badges at once does it not matter what they are oh god hey, the hey, bullet. wait a sec uh those intruders i wanted to ask what crime have they committed? Existing. They're plotting to overthrow the architects and bring harm to the city. Oh my god, who told you that? Huh. Reminds me of the accusations against me. Kokolia's methods haven't changed. Don't say that, Serval. I know that you're still nursing a grievance against the Supreme Guardian. But this isn't a joking matter. Yeah, I like mine though. I just want the tree and the founder's badge. Yeah, you have to pick one girl. You can only have one. You're telling me off again? Fine. Whatever, bro. You better be going. Come listen to Pela in my next rehearsal. I will. If I have the time. Yeah, get out of here. We have a mission to go on. The coast is clear. You can come out now. He literally just left. He could turn around and come back. Oh my goodness. Phew. I nearly suffocated. 
What kind of plot device was that? I almost lost my cool when he went for his flask. This is bad. Rania's in danger. We have to go save her. Attempting to storm Klipoth Fort by ourselves? Forget it, Zila. I don't care how skilled you are, I'm not sending you on a suicide mission. Rest assured, Kakolia may have changed over the years, but she never hurt Branya. I'm certain of that. Are we sure? You sound like Branya herself. I don't get it. You guys are against Kokolia, and yet in some ways, you seem to trust her completely. I know, it's like they don't know that voices are telling her what to do. Um... I'm gonna say, have you thought of a way to I persuade Jafar? I was gauging his reactions just now. Did you see? Unless we have irrefutable evidence, he won't question Kokolia's orders. If you go after him now, our plan's as good as over. Come on, let's go to the restricted zone. If we can get ahead of the curve and find the Stellaron, Kokolia will be out of options. Don't they know where it is too, though? Like... <laughs> We're gonna have to, like, fight her fucking way through and is they can Brian just, like... really safe? Waka. You care about her, huh? You must have become close friends. Come around and have a look. Uh, close is a bit much, but I made her a promise. Relax. She's the strongest girl I've ever seen. <laughs> I can believe that. I was waiting for them to stop talking. <laughs> oh, they jacked up security, all right. How the heck are we gonna sneak in? Serval, we need one of those brain waves. Leave it to me. Stick close, guys, and don't get spotted. Oh. Trick the guard and get into the restricted zone. Okay, how do we do that? This is a military base. Trespassers aren't allowed in. Wait, isn't that... <laughs> Serval! Long time no see. Well, if it isn't Franz. Long time no see. You still watching the entrance? <laughs> well, you see, I... Shade. You haven't changed, Serval. Still nailing us to the wall. So, what brings you over here at this hour? And who are the guys behind you? Okay, what a trash military if they don't even know what we look like. I mean, to be fair, they were, like, anime drawn picture, wanted posters, and shitty ones. My brother so. said the restricted zone energy lines were malfunctioning. Told me it was urgent. He doesn't trust those contracted maintenance workers, so he got me in for free. These guys are my assistants. We need to overhaul all the installations here. Uh, I didn't hear anything about the energy lines malfunctioning. Shut, Franz. Oh, please. This is a technology division issue. Why would they tell you guys? Come on, let us in already. If the heating system goes down in the middle of the night, are you going to be responsible for all the frozen corpses? Just fucking gaslighting him. Shoot, telling me the soft sounding guard wouldn't let. Yeah, right. No, that's uh, not something I could handle. <laughs> He's bending to our will. Seeing as you're Captain Japard's sister, it should be fine. Okay. Ha, here are some nerd. temporary passes. Oh, and remember to give them back to me when you leave. Thanks, Franz. I'll put in a good word for you with my brother and get him to promote you. No, no. Captain Japard hates all that under the table stuff. I'd have a better chance if you don't mention me at all. Doesn't sound like he wants to leave his post here, so. Yeah, look at this one. Maddox. Look at this lady. Ooh. We don't really have any, like, good characters at the moment. We got Dr. Ratio. We, this is the main character. Uh, Sparkle is super cute. Just got a little, little QB thing. And then, yeah, we got Natasha. Little healer girl. Uh, we got March. She's very eccentric. We got Don Hung. We got this dude. <laughs> this researcher lady. This little chick. And we also have her. Serval. Who else do we have? Herda. She's like a automaton doll. We just got this lady. Uh, we pulled her. And then Arlen. Serval the best. So far, you haven't met Kafka yet, okay? Like, Kafka is like the mommy vibes. I wish I could, like... I don't think she's anywhere that you'd be able to see at the moment. Like, who? look at this chick. 
We need her. Yeah, I don't think I can find Kafka anywhere. It wouldn't just be like online. Oh wait, wait, technically? Yeah, no. Oh, wait, okay, yeah. Also, hi, Fudge! Wait, who came in? Uh, Theo and Fudge, hello, hello! Um, friends, 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 friends. Here we go. And then, how do you... Here she is. This is the mommy vibes. <laughs> Kafka. Ooh. She's got, like, I should just go do like a daily. Oh, what the? Who is this girl? She's so cute. I'm, I'm gonna get Silver Wolf one day. Um, wait, what are my. Here. Let's go to. We'll just use some here. Um, here. If you're still here, I will show you this girl. We're stealing her from you, Fudge. We meet again. She's fucking sick as fuck, though. She's got, like, a sword. Like, look at her fucking sword. Isn't she fucking sick? And then her, like, follow-up attack is, like, a fucking Uzi. I'll see if I can get her ult. Okay, you ready? You ready? I'll slow it down. Here we go. Here's her ult. Good times never last. Here we go. Time to say bye. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is the one to get. Yeah, she's fucking cool as fuck. I can't wait to get her, whenever that may be, whenever her banner Damn comes back up. Oh, we're also rolling these guys because Fudge has her at like level fucking 80, so I'm just using their <laughs> character. I'm excited to where see where the, like that that area is. Sorry, okay. What did everyone say? Did someone say Kafka? <laughs> yeah. Right, right, the data the data bank thing. Yeah, I love her fit too. She's really cool. Alright, I go focus. Yeah, bye! Might be a while con. No, don't tell me that. Isn't there like possibly a chance I can get her just like from any warp though? Or is that not a thing? Oh, we already finished. Woo, that was easy. Sorry, I cannot exist with all these like little things pinging me. Okay. Back to what we were doing. Is that all? I'm aware that there are those among you who see the reserve units as a vacation. But let me set one thing straight. You are gravely mistaken. This is the restricted zone. The fragmentum before you conceals monsters that watch your every move. Behind us, we have a band of conspirators that have infiltrated the city. Wait, what? Does he literally mean behind him because we're behind him? Is critical. The lazy and undisciplined among Kefka you will, will not come back for a while. Oh. Us. She just had a rerun. No. As such, starting from today, we will be adding 200 bench presses and 30 extra minutes of one arm planks to our daily drill. Yes, sir. Well, I will just have to steal her from you, Fudge, whenever I do my dailies. See? <laughs> that was easy. You're Japard's sister, all right. Hmm. I haven't seen one of those for a long time. Hmm. Is this literally Don Hong's voice actor? The zone virtually never allows outsiders in. Damn. Raylene, we're just gonna have to wait. You guys are you lucky. You see that mechanical gear bridge? When you cross over to the other side, you arrive at hell on Earth. 
Uh, An exactly endless fragment. A few exhausted Silvermane guards, and the stench of death in the air. If we want to progress further north, we will need to cross that hell. Are you ready? Here comes exactly. Scar. We've got nowhere left to retreat. <laughs> Let's go then. First, we need to think of a way to get to the other side. I help set the underlying mechanisms for this type of gear bridge. It's controlled via different terminals in combination. Uh, I'll put Let's it in the chat in a second. I'll see the reason I'm making so much money. Yeah, he, <laughs> she's just, she just rolls, okay? Like, even if yes, but what whatever I'm fighting isn't even her, like, type, so like, it doesn't matter. <laughs> she just rips through them. He's a Landau. Uh, my UUID, it is up here, up here. Here you go. Whoever wants to add me. But yeah, you're welcome. Hello. <laughs> Mechanical Fever released a new song. Did you hear it? Oh, sure did. Halo was on lead vocals this time. Scared me half to death. It's a completely different style. Even mechanical fever is changing. <sighs> Rock and roll's dead. There's no audience anymore. Don't be so pessimistic. They're just keeping things fresh. I thought Halo was pretty good. Okay. <sighs> nope. This terminal's offline. We can't control it from here. So let's look for another. Every platform linked to the gear bridge should have a similar terminal. I never would have guessed that Japard and okay, you were brother okay. and sister. I can't say I Can blame I you. Oh, nope. We're nothing alike in personality or interests. In our family, we have a strong military tradition going back generations. Many a Landau has died in their prime. There's not a lot of brother and sister time. I'm just waiting for Everyone her to finish just talking. Does their best to get on with their life. Okay. Um There we go. Take me away. Oh, where are we going? Detecting obstacles on the way. What? Is it me? <laughs> Is it me? <laughs> it was me. <laughs> okay, I'll get it. Where? How do I get it? <laughs> uh, uh, friend request. Uh, ooh, who do you have? Oh my god, where did you go? Where did you go? Oh, are you Gojo? Ooh. Ooh. Wait. What the fuck is this version of him? <gasps> he looks fucking cool. Damn. Okay, okay. Let's keep going. There's so many cool characters in this game. <laughs> okay. That's broken, that's blocked, so this is the only other way we can go. Um, okay. Darn! Can't activate it. It seems like someone severed the energy supply to the terminals. Uh, so someone's deliberately trying to create trouble? I... Huh. You know, the more I think about it, the more it seems deliberate. With the front line on high alert, they must have rotated the bridge to make it impassable. Then they cut off the energy supply to the terminals to avoid accidental repositioning. Or to prevent deserters from escaping. That way, even if the front line were to collapse, the fragmentum monsters wouldn't be able to make it to the other side. Can you, um... Oh, you're still building him? Well, they look fucking cool as fuck. Oh, I want Silver Wolf so much. Ugh, oh, she's so cool. I love her energy blades. But side note, can you like rewatch cutscenes in this game? Like, is there like some sort of, I don't know, unending journal where you can like go back and replay them? Um, they cut off their only retreat. Branya was right. 
The Silvermane guards really are risking their lives to protect Bellabog. Oh, you can't. Just my conjecture, but I doubt it's far from the truth. My brother mentioned that they've had to use extreme measures to repel the Fragmentum monsters. Let's press on. We can't activate either of these terminals, so let's look for the energy supply installation itself. Wow, I feel like I started playing at like a good time, but also like not. So I missed Kafka. Hello. Aren't you the maintenance people? What are you doing over here? You can't just go wherever you please in the restricted zone. Get to work. Oops. Oopsie, don't mind me, I'm lost. I like listening to them because they're part of the story. Um, I wanna go check the other side. Hello, random stranger, hope you're doing well. Hello! I don't know what to call you, I, I am dead? Dead? <laughs> I hope you're doing well too. Oh, we can't listen to this guy? I feel like he's contemplating really, really tough shit. Actually, how far does this go? I would like to explore. Before I leave this place. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Did you hear Malik is being reassigned? It seems like uh, both the front line and go the city are short-handed right now. Seriously? No way! I thought Malik had only just been promoted. Mysterious. Feels like uh, something big's about to go down. As long as it's away from the front line, I'd happily be reassigned. It's only been a year since I enlisted. I'm not ready to lose my life. Eh, you make it sound terrible. Good luck preserving anything with those idlers in the reserve units. Our purpose as Silvermane Guards is to protect the citizens of Bellabog. <laughs> Are these gonna are these people gonna tell me to leave? Why are they all just standing here? Okay. Going back around. Not gonna lie, I didn't realize what game this was until after you clicked on the stream. <laughs> yeah, I just started playing it like last week. You like literally a week ago. Is a military Oops. base, temporary work. My bad. Don't kill me. What the shaped like a giant iron ball the other honka you mean genshin and it's behind a gate what are the odds oh honka impact is okay this is like my first hunt. um it's connected honka to all the energy lines game in general it covers the entire restricted zone mm. no wonder it's so heavily guarded one unit for everything that's a disaster waiting to happen we learned the hard way as long as we can gain We're just doing the main story the hub, right now. We can operate the beat this planet. Um, well, the guards That's get why suspicious. I told them we were here for urgent maintenance. The frontline equipment needs servicing just as much as the rest. So that's why you went for maintenance. Way to go, Serval. I mean, we're I lucky she's like a mechanic. <laughs> or Come on. Let's see if that This would not fly if she was pass. not a mechanic. Are you the emergency engineers? I saw you guys hanging around. Did you find the problem? <laughs> His voice acting. I, I'm, I'm really liking it so far. I haven't really played like a lot of gacha games, especially ones that, I don't know, let you run around like this too. Like I played a bit of Genshin when it came out, but like the story didn't really grab me. And then I've just been playing this other gacha called Reverse 1999, but that's like turn-based. Like there's no like open worldness, like like Honkai, um, like this Honkai and Genshin, so this has been really fun, so. And yeah, I really like the story so far. I would definitely Not recommend downloading it. Everything looks normal <laughs> so far. I think the problem is stemming from the energy hub. If you let us in, we can do a routine service inspection. I've worked on various iterations of this type of installation. And look how cute all the designs are. Look how pretty they are. <laughs> no, no. One of us. No one of do. us. No one gets near the energy hub without the security captain's encryption key. Everyone should play uh, this not game. Not even the Supreme Guardian? The Supreme Guardian? Hey, no games, you hear? No dice without the encryption key. Uh, don't 
Darn, this guy's not stupid. You need the encryption key, right? Which captain should I bother then? Uh, uh, captain Dunn's resting up ahead. Go and find him. If he grants you permission, I won't stand in your way. Darn. Dunn? What have I gotten so? myself into? You're Your gonna find out. We'll be back in a bit. <laughs> it is Sir a lot Ball, of fun. Dun, oh, we gotta wait for it to him? speak. You bet I do. We go way back. He's easy to talk to. Watch me persuade him. Okay, we're gonna watch, girl. Hey, Let's go. Dun. I'm gonna drink my tea. It's been a while. I didn't know you made security captain. Serval, it's been a long time. You're still so... <coughs> Allow me to introduce my assistants to you. They help me take care of business at the workshop. Everyone, this is Captain Dunn, an old friend of mine. He used to be an ace on the keys in the band. Oh, you play rock and roll too? Cool! Pleased to meet you. Oh my god, can you imagine if I said something smells weird? I'm not gonna say that. You're gonna drag me into the cult. Into a cult, yes. The punk guy star real cult. I mean, it's free to play, so just download it, Hello. play a bit of it, and if you hate it, uninstall it, but I'm enjoying it. Wow, oh wait, never mind, she's smell? commenting on a weird smell. <clears throat> Zachary! How many days has it been since you showered? Ew. Uh, I showered right before my shift. Hmm? What did you say? I... I haven't showered in two days, sir. Unacceptable, especially in front of visitors. Apologies <laughs> for the embarrassment, all. It's not a big deal, Dunn. Uh, you know, if you get a chance, would you want to get on stage with us again? She's using her charm. My keyboard guy. Damn poor guy, I know, right? Did he actually I shower beforehand, or did he just get pressured into saying he hasn't showered in two days? <laughs> that was a long time ago, Serval. I haven't touched a keyboard in ages. Besides, I'm stationed here all year round. I'm afraid I don't get many chances to return to the city. Though I don't stand on ceremony. Uh, how may I assist you? If everything's in order, you'd better head back to the city. He's now got a stinky here. reputation. I've checked the lines. There don't seem to be any major problems. All that's left is the energy hub. Good thing we don't know his name and he looks the same as all the rest of them. The guard over there said that I needed an encryption key to open the gate. Can you help me out? <sighs> don't be hesitant in front of your dream girl oh by the way the options uh like text options are very sassy oh wait his name's cap oh my god his name captain dung oh my god <laughs> yeah let's add a g on the end there okay well i'm not gonna say don't be hesitant in front of your green dream girl i feel like he's gonna like be like no so we'll be on our way after we run a checkup but still poor guy, right? These three will know at least. These three, especially this guy over here that's like standing next to him. Anything wrong done? Uh, sorry, Serval, but can you tell me what Captain Jappard told you? Huh? Oh, uh let me think. Hey, sis, the energy supply lines in the restricted zone have malfunctioned. Those useless engineers can't find the problem. Something like that? I like how she tries to, like, pretend to do his voice, too. Jedi! Hello, hello! How are you? Are you streaming today? Did you say you were going to stream Resident Evil or something? Dung probably shat himself when he saw her, to be honest. Probably, honestly. And may I ask, when did he contact you? Literally, like, 20 minutes ago. Uh, this morning? Yeah, that's right. He's on urban patrol duty today, right? That's why he popped around and asked the favor. I'm scared. Uh -huh. Captain Jappard just returned to the front line. I could reconfirm with him. Huh? Uh, hold up, he's back. Uh, that can't. Oh be. no, he's, he's gonna still in the city this. a little while ago. <laughs> I was thinking of streaming a little bit. Yeah, I should, but my sleep schedule has been kind of fucked. Well, health first, girl. Health first. <sighs> you haven't changed, Serval. You're still a lousy liar. These oh, no, people you brought, they're, they're not workshop assistants, right? Uh, girl, you fucking... Serval, it's not that I don't want to help you. 
But you should remember that I'm a Bellabog Silvermane guard. Okay, time to get our hands dirty, guys. We gotta take Look this guy this. out. You can leave, and I won't tell anyone about this incident. But the outsiders must remain. There goes the negotiation. You can negotiate with my fists, my bat, your little spear, um, whatever the heck Serval uses. <laughs> Mm, we'll say Serval, you should go. We can handle him. What sleep, right? I'm night shift, therefore my sleep's good. But you may be going to a end. new shift, though, right? We're trying to? Day shift? Done. This concerns the fate of Bellabog. No, the fate of our whole world. Please, don't stand in our way. Serval! We used to rehearse together every day. You must understand. Yeah, you must understand, Done. My rock and roll soul is to uphold the dignity of a soldier. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Served a list. Yeah, exactly. Oh wait, we are fighting him. Hell yeah. Okay. Ouch. And none of these people. Are okay. Let's make it quick. Naughty child. Wait, he's getting more? What the fuck? I'm asking questions. I do need to heal him when he comes to the person. Let's go. Yeah. I should probably heal him. That's better. Not bad. Five points. Just get up. Oh my god. Rules are made to be broken. Let's get rid of all these unnecessary people. Um yeah. we'll do that. Um, Let's play. Can you find the answer? I'm waiting for Norman to get situated. Okay. Oh no, he's sick. What? Okay, I should have healed my person, but... It's fine. We're gonna take him out right now. I didn't realize how little health he had. Yeah, that was easy. <laughs> Yeah, well, hopefully he gets well soon. Not COVID, my... just regular sickness. I'm sorry, Dunn. Time for a little nap. <laughs> He's just unconscious. Don't worry. Yeah, don't fuck with us. Stubborn fool. Strong, though. Wildfire lacks people like him. Got it. The encryption key. Quick, before we attract attention, let's... Oh. What's happening? Captain Dunzo? Oh my god, Khan. <laughs> That's the enemy attack alarm. Every Silvermane guard in the reserve zone just became our enemy. Wait, but how did they know? We literally are, like, alone back here. Who would have found out? If we work together, we can break through their ranks. We've made it up till now. I could lose an arm and a leg for all I care. I have to lay eyes on the Stellaron. He said it's been because of the shift weather change. Oh, um, yeah, it's it was uh, really sunny out today. Actually, like I went for a walk yesterday after work and it was super sunny, super nice. Literally like an hour later, just fucking hail, just freak hail. And then like 30 minutes after it hailed, it was just pouring rain. I was like, what is going on here? And it's like super sunny outside right now. Yeah, it's like summer. Quick, back to the energy supply hub. Anyone that tries to stop us is gonna find out a thing or two. Well, good thing I, know I can he had just... The key from the oh, start. fully healed. Yay. I could have snuck in and taken it off him myself. Shoulda, coulda, woulda, Sila. Mm -hmm. Activating the gear bridge alone would have been enough to expose us. I'll go easy this time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nap time. Damn. 
answers. Answer me. Let's play for a while. Just a scratch. Easy clap. from London so the weather here is bipolar and hates everyone oh my god yeah I'm in Canada same here it's been raining a lot I love rain though you're about to walk these two hell yeah oh but in front of my computer oh on your treadmill okay that works too dude I was fucking sweating today I think I need to like just start going on walks and like my fucking workout gear at this point I don't want to kill everyone can I kill these people too Die, bitch. <laughs> oh, did I not get one? I'm asking questions. I do definitely want to stream some RE4 though. I got tonight and tomorrow off. Hell yes. Are you playing some of it off stream too? It is a convenient- I don't like driving in rain, so... This could be... I'm considering getting one of those mini bike machines you put on Baby Dash. I think I need it. Yeah, El- um... Oh, Tansy! Also, hello! Thank you for the for the resub. Also welcome, welcome. Looks good. Um I was gonna say, yeah, Elle got like a little um portable like treadmill for her for her desk. Okay, I feel like this is going to be the way. There we go. Wait. No, that didn't work. Oh lord. How do I get this one? Um... Oh wait, here we go. Okay, we're cooking, we're cooking. We're not cooking. Um. Okay, we made it by trial and error. You walk everywhere so constant. Okay, yeah, that would. <laughs> you finished it, you cried. Oh my goodness, girl, you finished it so fast. What the heck? Or I could just get up and go on my treadmill. Oh, but you know, I mean, but you could have one right on at your desk though. The portable one. I feel like I did overcomplicate that. <laughs> okay. Um What's that? Oh my god, Tim, thank you for the follow. You better be downloading the game right now. <laughs> You have to join the cult. Actually, can I? No, I cannot. Let's make it quick. That'll take more than that. I feel like he should not be able to recover from the break after I break his shield. Yes. Just as my calculations predicted. I'm gonna kill all of them. I'm gonna go run around. I'm asking questions. Answer me. They're also giving, so this guy that I'm using right now, this Dr. Ratio guy, they're giving him like away for free right now um, through the mail. And apparently he's like, he is OP. He's like That'll take more than one of the mains on my team. So, but uh, 
Yeah. I have no life and Which friends, so if I get it, I'll probably play it too much. Oh. oh, wait, he's looking at me. Okay, we're good, we're good. I... I've just been looking for, like, a new game to play. Not necessarily, like... Wait, is this... Not necessarily like a gotcha game, but like it has a story and stuff, so... I mean, technically, I did want to play a gotcha game. The one I was playing, uh, Reverse 1999, it's like... It's cute, and I like the battle system and stuff. It's just like the story literally makes no sense, and the English translation... Uh, English transi translation no. is awful. So it makes e things like even more fucking confusing. Sorry, I like butchered like all my words here. Oh shit. Your answers? Answer me. Oh, but I got a better idea of how the gameplay works. Okay. Yeah, I definitely Just do want to play my that. I've been going on Val trying to find friends since I don't go I don't really play any other online games. I don't play any shooter games. I feel like not that they're toxic, but like yeah, I feel like That's not the crowd I want to be around. <laughs> also, I'm old and I'm bad at aiming, so... Okay, one of these guys has got to be... Yeah, one of these. One of yes! Okay, we're good, we're good. Yeah, they're pretty toxic, but all I do is sing. Are you sick? I'm asking questions. Test. Did that hurt? <laughs> Also, I could put this on auto battle, but I like um, I like uh, playing the game for myself. <laughs> Your answers? Answer me. I'll go easy. This is our chance. Yeah. Uh, I turn. Questions. Oh God, I turned 32 this year. I mean, I'm not as old as some, but. <laughs> Let's I play feel for a while. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm actually gonna heal. Mediocre. No power team oh my god, wait, I didn't even know Dr. Ratio was like so fucking dead right now. Holy shit, okay. This is our chance. Definitely gotta go heal him up. Just as my calculations predicted. Where was it? Bro, that did like nothing. Keep at it. Keep at it. Keep at it. Good enough. 32. Honestly, didn't expect that every other stream so close to my age. Yeah. I mean, I used to stream a few years ago um, before like I changed to VTubing. But uh, I do it more so nowadays that I do not live with my parents and stuff. So, I mean, I'm living with them right now temporarily, but that's just because I'm trying to find a place to live. <laughs> I like single player games anyways because I like to play at my own pace without people telling me how to play. Oh yeah, for sure. I also just like stories in general, so. I'm the resident old woman here. I don't know, Je 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 Yeah, I don't want to call it out Jedi. <laughs> We're in. I just want to have people to play this since being in my room alone. Oh no! Well, you're always welcome oh, here. Oh, Unfortunately, I do not have a Discord up and running yet. I plan to, I just haven't made one yet. Need some time. Who designed this operating system? It's so unintuitive! Emergency fire evacuation system. Not that. Rock and roll dance. Come on, like, I'm going to check my tea mode? while we listen to this. There's a bit left and it's getting cold. One of my songs! Your bridge control terminal. <laughs> Still found it. Oh, I will for sure. I'll definitely, there'll definitely be like a stream Let's post about it. As, or, like, I'll say it on stream as well. Probably say like, uh,. It'll probably say like announcement again, like I did the other day. But give me one second because I have an art commission and someone's asking me about it right now. Um, so give me one second. Uh, 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 what did I send this person?
Okay. Sorry. Woo, woo, woo. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> uh, or not me do art, but like, I, or I mean, I do do art, but <laughs> um, I have a uh, commission that I'm getting done and they were just like asking to clarification. And I've been like waiting for this commission for like two weeks now and they said they'd get it done a week ago. So I was like, I need to go answer them right now so I can, <laughs> so they can continue. <laughs> Sorry, let me catch up on chat really quick. Um, yeah, story rich games. I mean, that's what like I mostly like play on stream. I don't really play like multiplayer games on stream just because I like to like my stream time is like yes, I'm gonna sit down with a game and we're gonna go through it like a book essentially, unless it's like Dead by Daylight or something. I'm old too, but it's all good though. I drink and know things, right? <laughs> but yeah, no, I do draw on the on the side too, actually. Also, Leon Kennedy is three years older than me. Oh, look, perfect. Oh my goodness, Trevor. Leon. <laughs> Everyone's a man crush. Um, Sir Ball, won't more Silvermane guards be waiting for us on the other side of the gear bridge? Yep. yep. Oh, actually, wait, we can go over here now. Then what's our plan? Well, either we reason with them or charge straight through the blockade. Can't Let's compete with here. Leon. <laughs> Who doesn't love uh, Leon? <laughs> Wait, why can't I use this? We just activated it, didn't we? Which one? Which uh, game is Rebecca from? Like which Resident Careful. Evil? There's a big guy up ahead. There's no other way. We'll have to fight. <laughs> if we can beat Svarog, we can beat this one. Let's go. Zero, okay. Who's like the counterpart in that? Or is it just her? Need I teach someone a lesson? Let's play. Can you find the answer? Let's blow this fucker up. Um. <laughs> Shot. <laughs> oh my god, thank god. I was like, if this doesn't beat him. I'm asking questions. A test. Zero points. <laughs> Naughty child. Not oh no, I should have fucking healed him. I'm an idiot. Justin, just a little something. Much better. Okay. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Rules are made to be broken. Oh my god, she does so much fucking damage. Holy fuck. Okay. We'll probably die on this turn. Let's make it quick. Yeah. Yeah. Can't get past the might of Dr. Ratio. Reach the end of the story in your own way. Um, she has a partner player. Okay, the game is hard though because you have to switch between characters and you have no storage box. Oh, rip. Is Billy the one? Billy like Carlos was just a one time. Well, Carlos is cool, so easy game. He living life now. <laughs> well, it's honestly a pleasure meeting and talking to you. Hope to talk again soon. I'm gonna head out for now. Yeah, take care. You have a good. You have a good rest of your day too. Or night. You're in London. I'm all the way in Canada. <laughs> so you're probably it's probably nighttime there, right? <laughs> have a good sleep. Thank you for Energy the follow restored. again. System online. Certification enabled. Come on, come on. Forty percent. Sixty-five percent. Eighty-five percent. I didn't finish my tea. I'm gonna finish it. We did it. We've gained access to the gear bridge. Let's move. Yeah, they said they were from London earlier. Perfect. Okay. We need to get to the front line. We could have a problem. Your brother may be there. He probably is. Hopefully we don't bump into him, but if we do, we'll just have to try and talk to him. <laughs> Some memes. <laughs> Are you sure you can convince him? 
I've probably got a 30% chance, or less. <sighs> Meaning it could end in a fight. Haven't you noticed yet? Most of our convincing ends in a fight. Yeah, but we come out on top, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> we need to be sure, Saval. If we can't reach a common understanding with your brother, will you stand with us? Of course. My word is my bond. I said that I'd stand She's with like, you I don't fucking ends, care about no I brother. I want to see the Stellar on it. I'm willing to lose limbs for it, so... <laughs> Before our next expedition, I need Himeko to teach me some negotiation. Oh. Um, I guess we don't really need to turn it anywhere at the moment. We do need, like, a heal, though. Keep at it. Keep at it. Okay, that's her so bro. Bob. Really is you. Wait, Japard, listen to me. When the sentry reported to me, I thought there must have been a misunderstanding. The enemy alarm had to be unrelated to your entry into the restricted zone. Perhaps the intruders had taken you hostage. And yet, step away from the intruders, Serval. Walk over slowly and stand behind me. You're different from them. I'm sorry. We have an understanding. I stand with them. Hell yeah. Give me a few minutes, just a few. I'll explain every- Enough, Serval. <gasps> Have you forgotten where we are? We Landals ought to know this place better than anywhere. The outer reaches of the front line against the Fragmentum. Bellabog's most strategic protective fortress. Yeah, but this is all the fucking Supreme every Guardians Every Silvermane do guard here. Every person here is ready to sacrifice themselves. Ready to spill their blood for Bellabog at a moment's notice. Yet here you are, leading fugitives into the restricted zone. Attacking my Silvermane comrades in arms. Hijacking the energy hub. Let me add this guy, he's Are annoying. Really worthy of the Landau name? Why do you think I've come here? We found a way to dispel the eternal freeze, to seal the fragmentum. It might be the only lifeline this world has left. If that were true, why oh, would you report to Madame Kakolia? Why would you sneak into the restricted zone and create chaos? She's the one causing it. You don't understand. The one preventing us from getting close to the truth is Kakolia herself. You have all seen the Supreme Guardian in person. Do you think you can act as you please because she didn't recognize your version of events? Listen to me, Jepard. The origin and spread of the Fragmentum is linked to the Stellaron. The meteorite in the architect's records, it's- I know about the Stellaron. It's exactly what the fugitives behind you are seeking. But the Madam Guardian has already revealed the truth to me. These people have ulterior motives, Serval. They want to steal this treasure from the architects. No, we don't. The Madam Guardian has warned me before that you were indulging in fantasy. That you'd been exposed to forbidden knowledge. And that you would bring destruction down upon Bellabog. Damn. I believe you, Serval. I believe you think you're acting with loyalty to the people. The fucking it's Supreme just... Guardian just like literally planted all these seeds in everyone's head. Guards, formation. Arrest these people. We could be inundated with fragmentum monsters at any moment. We have no time to waste on them. The forbidden is only forbidden to conceal the truth within. Kokoli is afraid that we'll seize on this knowledge. That the truth will spread far and wide. To save the world, we At must he's risk it young. all. <laughs> I've said my piece. Whether you believe it or not is up to you. Regardless, you should know by now your sister's never been one to back down. If there's something or someone you can't abide, you should stand up and resist. And if there's something you uphold, you should uphold it to the very end. Think thrice, Jeppy. What happened to Brainwave? I always say well said. <laughs> Hi, Bitcoin. Well, for the, judge. the story is going well. My gambling, not so much. <laughs> In my capacity as captain, I hereby order that these fugitives be arrested. This isn't like our childhood game, Serval. 
You won't get any leniency from me. The barrier hasn't been fixed yet. Don't try and be a hero, Jepard. Uh, didn't I tell you? All our negotiations end in combat. Good thing we're good at what we fucking do. Oh. And he's weak to Mr. Ratio. Okay, well, he better not kill us first. Oh my goodness, he is a little squishy cop. I'm gonna make you go ahead of him. Haha, pokey bitch. That's better. Not bad. Five points. Oh no, I don't have any left. Wait, where did this other guy come from? Um. Naughty child. There's no power like team power. Mediocre. Essayes per knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Is this game on Steam? No, you you just uh like download it from their website. Also, how do you lie? Don't forget. Oh yeah. Oh, true. Right. Okay. Let's I'm just gonna right now. Fuck it. Can you find the answer? Well, let's go kick you and do that. Oh. Dude, I'm just gonna end this guy's career right now. <laughs> oh, I didn't even have to kill anyone. I could have just went balls to the wall on him. So, girl, how you do? It's doing good. We're trying to beat this planet before I end stream, which is, I don't know how long it takes. Khan, how close are we to the end of this planet? I've never come up against anyone this relentless. Chrono told me that I have like to do a dungeon or something before I do the boss fight. I don't know. He just won't go down. He's as stubborn as I am. It could be an argument or a fight. He'll do both to the death. That's why he bugs the heck out of me. That's enough, Jepard. Take a look around you. You're the last man standing. Yeah, you suck. He's the last man standing, yet he's like one of the first people we took out in that I battle. Won't yield. We don't need you to yield. So I'll fuck you up. I don't want you to yield through force of arms. That wouldn't be a victory for us. Yeah, our goal is the same as yours. Sir Balls and Branya's. We just want to preserve this world. There's no reason to think. To we were just passing by us. in our space train and we decided to come here to help the people and look at the mess we've gotten into. Jepard, brother, surely now you can see the need for pragmatism. Even if you don't believe my outsider friends, you should believe me. Maybe I've wasted your trust. In which case, believe Bronya. Lady Bronya? Get out the letter. Whip out the letter. Should have showed him this first, Sam. There's nothing more to say, Jepard. The decision is yours. As a captain of the Silver Main Guards. I am duty bound to carry out the orders of the Dude, Supreme Dude, this Guardian. guy sounds exactly like L. If you're still in here, this guy sounds exactly like Dane in the Fourth Wing, like in the book we're reading right now. Like just duty, duty, duty. Like, yeah. Uh, we could decide for you. But Lady Bronya is the commanding officer for the front lines. According to military protocol, with the frontline directives of the commanding yeah, officer, he's duty. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was architects like. Architects behind the lines. Right. A soldier must remain at their post and await further directives. God, he's so fucking annoying. L, have you read any more yet? Like, have you read chapters like thirteen to twenty-four yet? I've only read like six, so like I'm like on chapter twenty or something. Um. Thanks for understanding. 
<laughs> what does that mean, girl? Two chapters a night. What are you doing? The Silvermane guards. The Guardian's orders are paramount and absolute. But there is something of equal importance in the oath we take. The people of Felibar. <laughs> to be fair, like I said, the first four chapters were like so short. <laughs> if we lose the people, like it took me like an hour to read. We lose the reason for our existence. Our fight with the Fragmentum monsters is for the sake of preservation. But our fight with you? I fail to see the purpose. Exactly. If you are truly able to prevent our endlessly unfolding misfortunes, then the people of Velabog are indebted to you. Yeah, so let us do our job. If you are using lies to mask your true intentions, using my sister and Branya for your own ends, I swear by Klepoth that I will carry out your punishment without an ounce of mercy. You're not lying. I promise you. You must be Zila. You are a skilled fighter. Your combat style is nothing like that of the guards. You're gonna read at work today, but you're kind of busy. I've just been, like, reading at my desk. <laughs> Regardless of what you believe, these guys have been a great help to the underworld. Many people would vouch for them. Got it. I got a Kindle to read before, uh, before bed in my bed, but I just read at my computer desk still. <laughs> Oh, he said, I'm sure. If I didn't you want wait to advance him. further There's northward, sign. you must traverse an area entirely corroded by the fragmentum. It's the only way to get to the snow plains on the other side. The guards can give you some time before the next wave of attacks is upon us. Oh, where are we now? Oh, there's a quest down there. You see? Brothers and sisters need to have a scrap once in a while to get back on good terms. Okay. As I mentioned, if we want to progress for now, if you're ready to get on stage... I didn't feel like listening to the rest of her. <laughs> Treasure? Kind of close, okay. I missed you saying that earlier. Let's go! As soon as the restricted zone gate is open, the monsters on the other side will turn out in full force. The guards will do their best to stall them and buy you some time. Once you've broken through the front line, there's nothing more we can do for <laughs> You're you. You're sweating? Girl, you running on that You'll thing? have to find out for yourselves what lies within the northern fragmentum. So, have you made up your minds? We're ready, I think. I didn't. Understood. I mean, I'm fully leveled, so. Keep your weapons close. This will be a fierce fight. Guards, open the gate. I'm scared. Oh, it's hot. Because it's summer. Are you dealing with attacks like this every day? It's a common occurrence. Guards, formation. Well, I'm going to make sure I don't owe the guards any favors when this is done. <laughs> for Bronia, for Bailabog, for Universal Bees. I'm going to say for Bailabog. <laughs> Here they come. Steal yourselves. Okay, how many battles is this? Three? Okay. Did that hurt? That'll take okay, more. Time. That was pretty easy. Wow, that's that felt kind of cheap <laughs> that it did that. Oh my god, she's so loud. Rules are made to be broken. I'm just gonna use it. Fuck it. Just, just a little something. 
I can't There's have nothing. him die on Let's make it quick. Also, I feel like Natasha does like fucking way more damage than March does. Like even when March attacks something with a frost weakness, it feels like she does shit. I told you, Jepard, the barrier hasn't been fixed yet. Don't try and be a hero. This is only the first wave. They'll have reassembled soon. I have to. Hey, Mr. Silvermane, listen to your sister. I can tell just by looking at you that you haven't fully recovered. <sighs> Outsiders, Zila, the second wave hasn't started yet. Make the most of this opportunity and make a break for it. Wait a minute. <gasps> I can redeem my own hydrate. Everyone in the chat hydrate. Because I realized I haven't had any water yet. Unless someone redeemed hydrate, hydrate and I didn't see. Huh? Uh, Sir Vol, aren't you gonna look for the Stellaron with us? My brother can't hold them back by himself. He wasted a lot of energy on us. Hmm. It's my responsibility now. This, if I'm not here to help, I don't know what might happen in the next wave. Yeah, we don't need to. We're fine. I want to go with you. I do. We know. Then she can't see the Stellaron. I wanted to catch a glimpse of the Stellaron with my own eyes, and now it's so close. It's funny because she's literally looking at one dead in the face, which is me. I don't think I will. I can't wow. abandon my brother and the other guards. I'm a Landau. It's up to you now. I believe in you. You've given me new hope. Damn, you had to get something to drink. Well, now Khan needs to. Get hold of the Stellaron before Kakolia <gasps> realizes what's happening. Check. I'm actually pretty good with my posture right now. Not a stretch though. Uh, we can't abandon you. Yeah, she needs to see it. Serval's right. Let's go. Oh. The guards have opened up a way through for us. We can't let them down. We'll hey, take March. a picture of it. Don't forget to take a picture of the Stellaron. Oh my god, I literally called it. Say no more. We're good at this. Don't worry. It's too much of a walk. Oh my god. <laughs> Where's that exercise? <laughs> Do you got roots holding you down in your chair? Oh wait, it's Himiko. Fragmentum activity is intensifying. Something's happening on Urelo 6. Shouldn't we go down there, Himiko? <laughs> Have faith in them. Besides, this is her first trailblazing expedition. How will she be able to look back fondly without a few twists and turns? Wow, they just think we're having a walk in the park down there. Yet we're like wanted fugitives. Are you bored? Well, <laughs> I understand. But we have lots of opportunities ahead of us. Let's leave the memories of this expedition for them. Perhaps, sorry. Mm -hmm. So you think they'll be safe, right? Yes. Hopefully. <laughs> we haven't seen any Eon or Emanator level imaginary reactions. Relax. This is a young person's adventure. We shouldn't interfere. At most, we could offer a little off-site assistance. What does that mean? We have like a laser cannon on this train? The fragmentum Jepard was talking about? Compared to this, the corrosion we saw in Backwater Pass pales into insignificance. Mm. There's a restless atmosphere oh, yeah. here. It feels like like there are loads of eyes staring at us. Get Sir those Ball steps said that in, the right? Stellaron was very likely hidden in the snow plains north of Bellabog. I'm at like 4300. If we want to get there. I'm afraid we'll have to find the exit to this fragmentum maze first. Oh, ew. That's too much work. Never mind. Never mind, Con. <laughs> this place makes my flesh crawl. Like there are insects under my skin. We have no guide and no way of detecting the Stellaron. We'll just have to advance gradually. <laughs> no, you understand. Well, now you made me understand. You Don't explain the situation. <laughs> the stronger the fragmentum contamination, the closer we are to the source. Okay. How fucked up are we gonna get here? Oh, look, he's so cute. Okay, here we go, guys. Oh, look! Up ahead on the ground! What this is... <gasps> Could she be here, too? She must be. This can't be a coincidence. Whoa! Quick, look! That's Branya! 
Wait, what the fuck? Is that Kakolia too? No. Not that emo. It isn't them. It must be a kind of echo. Some type of residual energy replicated by the fragmentum. Which means they were definitely here, right? And it looks like they went that way. <laughs> Just in time. We had no idea which direction to take. What did we get? A delicate snow globe. Okay. Well, we're gonna break everything first and run around. As we do. Objects that have been exposed to fragmentum corrosion might not be stable. I wouldn't touch that device if I were you. I'm exploring, you can't stop me. Dark Mills, hello, hello! How are you? We're deep inside. Let's look for other clues. March. I wanna go where I wanna go. Freaky. You still haven't told me what this place is, Mother. 700 years ago, this was Belabog's northern border and the site of an ancient battle. Here is where Elisa Rand led the first Silver Main Guards in resistance against well, the Leeches. Now, it is nothing more than an abandoned corridor filled with the sounds of old world echoes. Don't let its fragmented appearance fool you, Rania. On the day the promise is fulfilled, these ruins will become the breeding ground of a new world. Uh, Mother, do you truly believe the Stellaron's promise? It summoned the blizzard beyond our walls and opened the door of the Fragmentum. It destroyed our civilization. It- And yet, the crime of our ancestors was their inability to embrace that destruction sooner. What? From the moment those intruders descended from beyond the sky, this world was handed a death sentence. What? But the Stellaron. Has reserved for Just us got back with your food. Yum. There is a price to pay for new life, wiping away what every did you get? decaying vestige of the old world, renouncing the meaningless and lingering struggle. This is the price the Stellaron demands. When the promise is fulfilled, Bronya, no longer will we have to under our lives, guarding this wasteland. You and I will witness the new world rise from the ruins. Yeah, something tasty. Oh. Okay, well, she's psycho. This is a complex mechanism. How did they get past? <sighs> I knew this wouldn't be simple. Uh, wait, wasn't there some big energy hub looking thing back in that empty area? Let's go back or and take Mar a look. Or March, always like stating escape. the obvious. <laughs> uh, I can't say I like the idea of interacting with our surroundings, especially this deep into the fragmentum. However... However what? However... There's no other way. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Perfect, keep stopping. Huh. Even Don Hung the Sensible has his adventurous days. Because she's loco. <laughs> it worked, right? But the gate Cuckoo didn't move yeah. an inch. Are there other units around? Hmm. It's clear that whoever designed these mechanisms didn't want outsiders to get through too easily. Let's keep looking for the energy hub. Ooh. Now we get to go over here. Oh. Look, over there! I think I can see the next unit. Dude, how big is this place? I see a Jew. Let's go. Oh, is this the kind of dungeon that like Chrono was referring to? Did that hurt? <laughs> I'm assuming this is like what he was referring to. Reach the end of the story in your own way. What's down here? Ha. I must know. Is it a formidable foe? No, it's not. Oh, free stream, wop stream. Billy Cheesesteak, what? 
Oh, I want yummy food. There's like leftovers in the fridge, like, um, like salmon and potatoes and stuff, but like, I literally just had that like on Sunday and then I had that for lunch. Oh, what was that? I meant to hit that one. I don't want salmon again, as much as I love Sam. Is that all? Oh, it is a formidable foe. Well, I'm just gonna snag that from you, and then I'm gonna leave. Bye. Strategy. I'll come back for you later. Can't believe I'm already on like able to like get to equilibrium too. Oh God. Okay. Um. Finally finished my chicken noodle soup. Oh, I want soup. Make me some. Oh, where are we going, little guy? Um. Okay, well I can't go anymore, so. Your answers. chance yeah. that'll take more than medicine mm. see I wish she did damn it didn't. oh yes <gasps> I picked right I didn't know it was gonna blow up Are those monsters guarding the energy hub it seems like it strange fragmentum monsters would usually destroy man-made objects Beerby, yeah, no worries. That's two. Did you hear that? This mechanism must be on now. Come on, let's find the next one. I don't know how we heard that from Where that far away, but the next mechanism. <laughs> oh, behind that gate. There's no switch. We need to find a way around. Oh, we know the way around. I've never seen such a desolate place. At least in Rivet Town, you could tell that people used. To Turn counterclockwise. Perfect. And now we can keep following the little guy. Where the hell is this? Oh god, what was this? Okay. Is this a fragmentum phenomenon that I haven't seen before? Not wise to get too close, I'd better check with the mystery end first. Uh, what is this, Mr. Yang? And I was gonna be like, what the fuck is going on down there? <laughs> it appears to be a rift in space, torn open by the fragmentum as it erodes reality. The scientific scientific name for this phenomenon is Cavern of Corrosion. No one knows for sure what kind of space the caverns are connected to. However, research does indicate that valuable reality data is often scattered within these caverns. As with the calyxes, the, the derivatives of the fragmentum always carry un unidentified risk. Please exercise extra caution if you wish to explore further. Can I come back to this? Defeat enemies to obtain relics. Oh shit. Ooh yay. Oh sick. Hi gal. Hello, hello. How are you? I'm sorry. I need to kill this guy first little thing that we're following. Did that hurt? Actually, can I get him? Sir. Let's make it quick. What? He gets to retaliate. I'm asking questions. Good, just chilling. I'm good too. We're trying to we're trying to beat this planet. Really, that's my goal for stream, is to beat this planet. Okay. 
Okay, everything is Gucci. Let's click on it. <laughs> L, I was telling Gal, I was like, we should have our own compound anniversary event. Like, fuck it, like, let's just grab some people, throw in some mixes, and have a good time. I want to ask you a question. Uh, ask away. Do you still remember those dreams you mentioned to us? Yes. I know you're wide awake right now, but I need you to try. See if you can recall the voice you heard. Mm, close eyes and meditate. You try to recall the dreams. As your train of thought deepens, the voice comes to you. Yes. I should, like, see if I could put my own mix together. DJ wow. Neota in the house! She's a VTuber. She's an artist. She's a DJ. I'm just kidding. I'm not a DJ. I would literally just splice the songs together in FL Studio. Um, there was a voice calling out this to This is merely Kulia. speculation, but perhaps the voice you heard is the Stellaron somehow conveying information to Kokolia. And the one in your body is resonating with the Stellaron on this world. I mean, I'd totally be down with it. Huh? You mean that Stellarons can communicate? I've never heard that before. Well, there's never been a human that could accommodate a Stellaron. Oh shit, I didn't even- I almost bit my tongue there. Um, I didn't even real- I totally forgot. We're a Stellaron, so that's probably why we're hearing the voice of another Stellaron. Um, a Stellaron has already warned Kakulia. Then, aren't we walking straight into a trap? You almost yes. fell off? Oh my goodness, Elle. And Branya may well- Don't injure yourself. <laughs> Don Hung's speculations are usually right on the money. But even if we've guessed right, we can't go home now. <laughs> There's no way back anyway. At least Kokolia won't catch us off guard now. So what if it's an ambush? We're not about to lose now. I have to save Branya, beat Kokolia, and crush this Stellaron thing to dust. And we're gonna. Don't worry, girl. I'm a professional at injuring myself. You actually are, though. <laughs> okay, wait. Let me check what, like, all of this is. Okay. The Atlas. Okay, that's whatever. And this. Ooh, we got an extra assignment limit. Hell yeah. Fuck, I don't know what I want to send the people out on. I'll come back to that later. I'm determined to finish the story first. Okay. Um, we need to turn this counterclockwise again. Yeah. Nope. Um, no, yes, that was right. But we have to run all the way back around. I think we're all in pretty good shape health-wise, so... I'm asking questions. Answer me. Did that hurt? This is our chance. Naughty child. No, he literally has like a sliver of fucking life Your left. Are you joking? Oh, three. Oh, I do not care to do that. Sleep. This one's almost like falling off the fucking planet here. We're one step closer to Branya. Let's move. Uh, are these echoes too? Hydrate, posture check, stretch. Okay, one second. <laughs> oh, I'm tired. Care package. Thank you. Mm -mm. 
I need it. Yes. The fragmentum here seems to have made a special connection with Kokolia. It's repeatedly generating forms in her image. Sheep, hello, hello. Wait, actually, no, this is gonna bother me if I don't fucking do it right now. <laughs> okay, I wanna see materials. I was kinda wanting to get money, but maybe I don't need it yet. I just don't know what these are for. Like, what the fuck? Synthesis materials? Okay. I'm just going to send these people out again. Send them out again. And. You know what? I'll just send them out for money. Why not? Easy clap. Neo, I am live. I am live. I've been actually streaming quite a bit. Like this past week, I feel like I've streamed like. Well, let's see, Wednesday last week, Thursday last week, Saturday, Monday, and Wednesday. Yeah, I've streamed like five times. I Like the only days I haven't streamed on were like. Or no, wait, is that five? Well, I guess technically we're on the eighth day, but yeah. I took a nap today, but I still feel tired. I didn't take any nap. I don't understand. Even if the truth is as you say, every generation of Guardian has resisted the call of the Stellaron. Yeah, your mom sucks. And all of them have been wrong, Mother. Do you still not see, Bronya? There is no right or wrong here. Some of them acted out of human pride. Others out of human short-sightedness. Our ancestors, including Elisa Rand, spent their whole lives trying to prolong this civilization. Then, after all fell still, their memories were scattered by the blizzard. They spent lifetimes writing songs of praise that lauded the bravery of humanity but couldn't spare the time to gaze up into the stars to those entities of greater magnificence in the heavens above a thousand years is but a passing moment the attainments of insignificant beings nothing more than a footnote so basically she's um so basically she's just listening to a Stellaron that wants to like wipe out everyone on this planet and is promising her like a new civilization of like I people or something. I shall follow the Guardian's misguided steps down that blind alley of narcissism. If persistence is futile, then one must choose a new beginning. But Klipoth, the Reservation, are they not one of the magnificent entities you speak of? Is it not their strength that has sheltered Bellabog this entire time? The preservation. Has the preservation ever looked humanity in the eye? Right, Tamsley? Nothing more than an arrogant delusion of the architects. Kakuli is just, like, so delusional that she just doesn't want to, like, accept the fact that she fucking failed and couldn't stave off the voices in her head like other every- like every other Supreme Guardian could. You will hear. The real voice. She's like, shit, now I have to go with the bit. <laughs> then you will understand my choice. Uh, I hope we don't have to fight her. <gasps> um, ba -ba -ba. And I, uh... I don't know why that song was stuck in my head. Right, she's gone to Lulu. She is. Whoa, check this oh. place out. Tables and sentry posts? Had to claim it. <laughs> there must have been silver main guards stationed here once. This wasn't if the boss, were, was it? They left a long time ago. Huh. There might be valuable information here. Uh, shame we don't have time to look for it. Well, we'll come back later. Looks like another completely new monster. Yeah, she, yeah. It's a uh, L, uh, L, L, R. Oh my God, it's L in the chat. <laughs> She's the one. Um, we just have to like pick a time because she has an appointment at like. What did What did you say? Five thirty p.m. PST, like my time, and for like thirty minutes. So yeah, L said if we don't have a fourth by the time she comes home, she'll come play. But 
we didn't even set the time that we were gonna play it anyways, so <laughs> we can always wait for her. Considering where we are, it would be surprising if we didn't run into strange enemies here. Okay, go. I don't care how strange it is. It's Have a good lure. Thank you for the Let's care package. Okay, what are you allergic to? Lady in the middle here. Pray. Actually, I feel like I should hit her with Dr. Ratio. Okay, well, you know what we're gonna do? We're just gonna. Wait, should I go all out? If this isn't the boss, maybe I shouldn't do that. Okay. Okay, these guys aren't as hard as I thought. I feel kind of bad that I, like, wasted that. Oh, shit. Okay, okay. Naughty child. It's fine. I'm gonna heal them now. Much better. Let's play for a while. <laughs> Girl, stop hitting me like that. Just a scratch. I'm fresh shot. Ouch. There's no power in I'm asking questions. Answer me. I'll go easy this time. Mm. Let's make it quick. Naughty child. <laughs> Probably should have healed someone, but I just have to. Do. No way, she just recovered from her break like that? Seriously, I feel like if it breaks, it should reset the turn order. That's so fucking annoying. Also, what does this mean? I didn't even see, like... Jesus. I'm fresh shot. That's better. Your answers? There's no power in the team. Let's go. I'm going to assume that they're at stop, lady. Oh, my God, she killed him. Jesus. I want to save them with, like, if this isn't the boss, I want to save, like, all my skills. Or my ultimate. If I didn't know it was a product of the Fragmentum, I think we were fighting a human. Unlike those random low-level Fragmentum creations, this one seems to have a mind of its own. It seems to be able to use complex tactics. Look, Branya and Kokolia's echoes. They must have come through here. No shit, this is where we're following them to, <laughs> The voice they must is getting be really clearer. close, right? I sense that we're very near to the northern snow plains. Well, let me go <laughs> heal up because how do I get Dr. Ratio back if he's dead? Do I just run up to one of these? Oh yeah, that was easy. This is where the first guardian led the Silvermane guards into battle. She made huge sacrifices for the sake of temporary respite. But the otherworldly legion did not tire. She soon realized that flesh and blood could not contend with so ruthless an enemy. When all was nearly lost, she chose to set her sights on the Stellaron and made the first wish. As for what came later, you know as well as I. So. The Eternal Freeze was a disaster brought about by a human wish? <laughs> Ironic, no? All the Stellaron did was answer humanity's call. And yet we kept its existence a closely guarded secret for centuries. Even going so far as to attempt to use it to control the Stellaron. What is it? Woeful. <laughs> Laughable. It? Well, something created using otherworldly technology. An inhibitor that a corporation from the old world and the architects attempted to use to house the Stellaron. <laughs> oh, I know you have many questions, my daughter. 
Be patient. Soon you will have all the answers. I'm scared. Here we are, another one. Okay, I actually really like like connecting these. It's fun. It is super fun to connect them. Okay, bro, where are you taking me? Oh god, that's a lot. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, there's fucking like three of these battles or something. Make it quick. Yeah. That'll take more than medicine. I hate these ones. I'm asking questions. Answer me. Zero points. Let's go. That'll be your answers. Easy clap. I guess it's like not that hard to like gain it all back. Yeah, Trevor, I traded her out. I had March before, like the girl that does like shields. So I was like, oh, like maybe, like maybe I'll keep March. But yeah, no, having a heal is way better than having a shield. Got her at max Just at level like six. Wait, what? <laughs> also, hi, Brandon. Where are you taking? Ooh, a chest. Thank you. Okay, where are you taking me, boy? I do not want to fight that. Ooh. Oh no, I'm not gonna break it. I can't get around it. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Idle on level six. Damn. I'm asking questions. Okay, I'm gonna have to Justin, do this. Just a little something. Much better. Yeah, like at least she feels like she does damage too. That's the thing. Like March, like even if I hit someone, it still felt like she did like literally no damage. This is our chance. That'll take more than. Your answers. You hated March? I mean, I feel like she's dumb, goofy, and cute, but yeah, no, she fucking sucks. <laughs> Where are you going, little guy? Thank you. Am I even supposed to be going this way right now? Oh god. Uh, okay. It's fine. We're okay. You see nothing. March is pretty oh for niche subs, okay. Probably the most random unimportant day of the year as well. It's the day she was found, okay. Okay, you're not hitting me. It's the day she was found. God, I hate these guys. Stop. This is our chance. That'll take more than medicine. There's no power in this Zero points. God, he is too fucking OP. <laughs> Not <in> my <laughs> Oh my god, how close am I to the boss? It's that shadow of hers again. But Bronius isn't with her this time. It's only 
a fragment in the loot. Oop. It feels like Dara so Marshall will cover all her memories and she'll be the complete before. opposite of Jake. I have no idea, but I think that would be interesting. Intruders. Uh, did did she just speak? You cannot approach. Not good. March! Out the way! Okay, here we go. Let's go. Intruders! You go no further. Uh, are you sure this isn't the real her? It may look like her, but the fragmentum can only create mm. fortunes. Bring her down! Rules are made to be broken. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Like, could you technically just put this on? Can you do auto battle like for these boss fights? Oh no, you can't. Okay. Let's make it quick. Witness the avalanche. Let's play for a while. Let's make it quick. Your answers. Okay, she's definitely gonna hit us with something. Judgment of eternal winter. Oh. Well, I'll have you know, I could just heal for it. Jokes on you, bitch. I'm asking questions. There's no power like team. Please tell me. Damn, he's not gonna go ahead of her. Fuck. Let's go. Your answers? Okay. That didn't hurt as bad as I thought. Zero points. I'm assuming we fight the Stellar on the boss disappeared. Those stairs. It's the only way forward. Oh, Trey, thank you. Wherever they lead, it must be the end of the journey. I don't want to get to the end so soon. I want my journey to go on forever. Finish your 60. You did an hour holy. This means that Branya is up ahead. And so is the fate of the overworld and the underworld. Here, it's girl. All in our hands. I can throw it back at you. There you go. <laughs> Strange. I thought I'd feel nervous or afraid, but I don't. The only feeling I have is that none of this seems real. Um. Is this how trailblazing expeditions usually come to an end? Why well, am asking her that? Not always. Sometimes it's a happier conclusion. The Express has traveled world Hi, after Jane. world. We are merely passing travelers. Witnesses to part of a grander story. We invariably avoid getting drawn into turbulence that can decide the fate of a world. But there are always times when we have no choice but to act. Or to put it another way, this is one heck of a first trailblazing expedition. You hit the jackpot. I was about to bore you all with my gloomy reflections, but on second thought, not today. Adventuring with you guys by my side has made me feel like no obstacle is too big. Right on! But you can say whatever you like. A good adventure shouldn't be full of rules and regulations. Helping those in need, befriending those worth counting on, and saving the world a few times along the way. This is the spirit of trailblazing. <laughs> oh my god. Do I get to heal before I go over there? Okay, it just says keep going. I think we're good. Never mind. We will go heal first. Hmm. 
Maybe... I want to go get um, Natasha's ult ready. I'm okay. I'm asking questions. Answer me. Let's play for a while. This is our chance. <laughs> That'll take more than medicine. <laughs> okay, she needs to do at least like one more hit. <laughs> I think we're okay. I think we're okay. She'll get one more hit in. Let's go. Uh. Naughty child. Okay, there we go. That's all I needed. Answer me. Zero points. Okay, we're good. Hopefully we can do this in one go. In your own way. Everyone's healed up, right? 18 minutes. Yeah, okay. Okay, here we go, guys. I think I'm good. I think I'll be good. I have everyone at max level. I've leveled their, like, like cards. And, oops, I just got my glasses dirty. Um, I think we're good. Okay, one second. Sorry, I got a smudge on my glasses now. And I can't see. Okay. I think we're good. Mm -hmm. You can also make food that gives- oh yeah, 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 okay. Um, yeah, let's check our food. Sorry, I'm kind of getting far away from my mic. Oh, where's our inventory again? This is the boss, right? Um, okay. Consumables, okay. What are we going in with? What are we going in with? <laughs> Sorry, um... This trash one. Oh, I'm almost there? Oh, I'm not there yet? Okay, then fuck it. If this isn't the battle, then... Like, this is not... This is not the boss battle? Okay, I guess we're going in. Oh. We're sure this isn't the boss battle? Okay. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. I was worried. Here. The blizzard's so fierce. The power from the trailblaze path isn't enough to stop the cold. It means that we're getting closer to the Stellaron and the heart of the Eternal Freeze. I must explore. Oh, this is normal. Okay. Are there still baddies to fight in here then? I mean, I'm sure it'll ask me, like, are you good? Frozen remains of Void Rangers are scattered along the mountain path. Even the ruthless antimatter legion is helpless against the might of the Eternal Freeze. The Void Ranger remains are preserved remarkably well in the ice. You can't help but wonder. Perhaps March seventh is right. Either way, you think that it's best not to unfreeze them. Yeah, fuck that. Why would I unfreeze the these architects guys? Built this? Oh shit. Mm. Very different from the uniform style of the buildings we saw in the city. If Kakolia threatens us by taking Branya hostage. We have to save her. The underworld. No. The entire planet relies on her. Okay. Is this it? Is this it? Because, yeah, let me... Can I even synthesize anything right now? The trash can one should be good, but... Oh god, okay. I guess I can't synthesize anything here right now, can I? 
Uh... Okay. Um, how do I synthesize again? What can we bring with us? Um... We could do that. We could do this. I just don't know how hard are these materials to obtain. Should I just use it? Because they all make one of these and one of these. Okay, now I think we're ready. Okay. And we will use that. Wait. Did I do it wrong? Oh no. Okay, hopefully we're good. Uh, okay, here we go. We got an RP walk up there. <laughs> this is a bit slower than I was thinking, but <laughs> here we go. This is the stellar run. No. So dramatic, I know. I need a screenshot. Do not oh, I didn't mean to Branya. click that button. Accept the common will. No, I, I don't want this. Look upon their promised future, Branya. A world without poverty, without food, without yeah, because we'd be dead. A world where people <gasps> no Nothing longer smell. have to pray like prisoners for survival. A world that we. Can guard for all or we can just destroy it because that is literally what's causing all your issues. 700 years ago, we tried and fought unceasingly, believing that the radiance of human nature could shepherd us towards rejuvenation. <laughs> and to what end? A crushing defeat. Why, when faced with irrefutable strength, is our first thought always to resist <laughs> to cover our ears instead of hearing all right finally have home. yeah let's get it it is the conceit and cowardice entrenched in the depths of human nature so difficult to efface cast them aside Break free of the chains that bind you, the Stellaron. You're stronger than this, Romeo. You're stronger it than this. And they will. Your brainwashing ends here, you witch. Zila? You came. I thought the blizzards had entombed you. Hell no. You wish. We're not going down before you do. I'm going to take a screenshot. Dun, 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 dun. Where's my paint? There we go. Branya! I don't know what happened between you and them. Even if you explained it to me, I probably wouldn't understand all the crazy details. But there are two things I do know. One, these guys have come through hell to get here, to steal this Stellaron thing. And two, do you remember what I said? If anything happened to you, I'd save you. Do you understand? Even if the damage is done, even if you've completely forgotten our promise, then then I'm just going to have to knock you out and bring you back myself. She's just like, don't worry. The voice hasn't taken me over yet. I'm going to say... Shit, I don't know. These are both good options. I'll say Bellabog needs you. All of you. 
finished? I think I've given you long enough to bid farewell. It's time I told you my other reason for bringing you here. <sighs> what? I want to witness your choice. Look at her. She's like all frozen over. Is that from the Stellar Realm? I have told you all the truths there are to tell. The deal with the Stellaron, the wish I made to it. There are no more secrets between us. Oh, this would be a good photo. Wait, let me go put another paint. I need a I need a good thumbnail. This one looks pretty legit. Many years ago, the voice of the Stellaron sounded in my ears for the first time. I was no different from the previous generations of Guardians. I withdrew. Refused to hear. I was as you are now. Bitterly defending the Architect's so-called... Preservation. My conviction was once steadfast. Unparalleled. Until a sudden change arrived and threw everything into chaos. Another choice appeared before me. The subversion of the old order. And the welcoming of a new world. And compared to the illusory, ever more distant preservation, this was so... tangible. I have agonized, long agonized over how to convey all this to you. Inevitably, the promise tomorrow will transpire. But if you were not there beside me to watch over that new world, then I would descend into torment, Branya. Enduring torment. <laughs> Perhaps I should be thanking you, outsiders. The pressure you have imposed what? What? has at long last compelled me to confront my final weakness. Sir, final weakness. <sighs> Branya, throughout your life, I have never forced you to submit to my will. You have always, we wow, how nice always of you. have a choice. Ask them. So now, choose, my daughter. <clears throat> Fuck no. Madam. I am grateful to you for raising me and for allowing me the privilege of choice. But I... I am sorry, Mother. On this, our final occasion, I cannot stand with you. <gasps> Hello? You say that conceit and cowardice lie in the depths of human nature. <laughs> Perhaps you're right. Desperation sheds light on the darkest recesses of the heart. What about those simply struggling for survival, fighting for something better? I've witnessed their light on the front lines, in the underworld, in places you have overlooked. Our ancestors built this city, striving in the bitter snow to prolong our civilization. Even if this world is doomed to fall apart, we should allow humanity to pave the way to its final outcome, not hand over our fate to the seed of ruin. We are Guardian's mother, chosen from among the masses. Our duty is to preserve the world built by humanity. We are not gods. We are not arbiters. You seek to crush human nature underfoot while masquerading as an, as an arbiter and a god. I cannot let you... So... This is your choice. I understand, Branya. <gasps> What's gonna happen? She's gonna fuse with the Stellaron? Such a pity that you will never see that resplendent world. Unable to free yourself from the shackles of your mind. You know what? You were supposed to be the mother. Of the new world. Oh? The ground! It's shaking! What's happening? That sign! The fate of this city of Bellabog is sealed. Its future will unfold in our hands. And you 
will become the foundation of the new world. Ew, all our broken bones. You must break the old to build the new. The Supreme Guardian commands you. Rise, engine of creation! Oh shit. It's one of the architects' ancient machines! Watch out, all of you! Oh my goodness, where do we even start? How do we even let's test your knowledge? Let's play for a while. Engine! Break them! Wait, what? We have to stop it! <gasps> also, hello risk! I walked in on the right moment, baby. Make sure to use wait. Only one time speed? Okay. Okay. You're in bad shape. Titan stolen from FF15. Couldn't say I never played. Wait, I didn't see how many battles are there. Never stop thinking. Why don't you stay and play for a while? Mm. Yeah. I didn't realize these things were going to go next. Oh. Bro, he's like a mess. How can we bring a giant like this but it's so slow, I know, yeah, what the heck. <laughs> Look how slow it is. Um. I could probably kill this, so I'm probably gonna heal someone. Here comes the medicine. <clears throat> There's no power like team power. <laughs> yeah, holy Jesus Christ, that is so slow. Wait, it's just these three battles? That's it? SAS Perkipi. Knowledge is the measure of all things. It reveals truth okay. and falsehood. We gonna speed it up a little. <laughs> just, just a little something. <laughs> Not bad. Five points. Answer me. Make it quick. Zero points. That was was that it? That was not it. There must be more. Oh my god. I feel like the battle against like the fake Kakulia was uh, harder than that. There's no way.
Is it over? No, that can't be it. Damn, I'm like a fucking parkour expert. Oh shit, she's a sniper? Oh my god, this is so sick. I wish you could just take screenshots in this game. Like, I want to screenshot every single thing, but I can't. No! This gives me Final Fantasy XIV vibes, too. Stolen from FF47 Advent Children. The power granted by them. Oh god. No, I missed it. Listen to the power surge. Sing. How do I like get rid of the UI so I can take a photo? Because this, this is fucking sick. I want a photo of it. Just as it dispelled the antimatter legion seven hundred years ago, so too will it wipe you from the face of this world. Oh wait, it's just me. Stay alert. Okay. Um... Oh. Rules are made to be broken. And, oh my god, I do literally nothing. What? That does even less damage. Let's go. Um, how the fuck Let's am I supposed to beat her? I'm literally just hitting her over and over again. <laughs> Humanity, so weak and foolish, always we first overestimating saw yeah. their abilities. Let me bestow upon you despair. Yeah, this is a sick ass boss design. <gasps> She can't kill me, I'm a stellar run too. Oh. Am I gonna speak to the stellar? Is this Hydalin? Feel think hear <laughs> or whatever the fuck that is. I was fighting the Kolia. Why am I here? The last time I came here, I drew Nanook's gaze. Could it be? Damn, what is this place? Oh. The commercial district has fallen. We've transferred the residents to the outer municipal district for the time being. The garrison lost 26 fighters. But I... Go on, Jepard. This girl doesn't even fucking care. I... I'm not sure that they're dead. I saw their broken figures lingering in the fragmentum. What happened back there defied all reason. It was madness. Madam Guardian, if this continues... I know well the consequences, Jepard. Damn. You may leave. Why do you hesitate, Kakolia? Isn't this what you've always been hoping for? Oh, it's Get out of this cage and take a look at the city. What is there to lose? The efforts of our predecessors, their unfinished research. We can finally see them come to fruition. Give me some soldiers and I'll locate the Stellaron and find out how to save our world. You need to come to your senses. No, you need to come to yours, girl. Come to my senses? 
What are you? Guards, Miss Serval is tired. Take her to rest. Sequester her lab and detain the researchers. Their work is illegal. Why, Kakalia? Why have you grown so cold? Serval Landau, you were my most cherished friend. I like the sound of the feet. Um, Madame Kakolia, the monsters are surging this way. It's too dangerous here. Yeah, she's crazy. Do not hear. <laughs> Feast on their willful ignorance. Absolve them of their stupidity and fear. We're getting closer, guys. understand. The fragmentum corrosion has already spread to the underworld. How will those below ground fend for themselves if we withdraw every guard? The automatons will ensure their safety. The most important defensive position is here on the surface. If our lines crumble, the underground will vanish in an instant. Our defenses here must be maintained at all costs. These are the choices we make, Branya. As a leader, you must harbor the courage and foresight to choose. You, me, and every Silver Main Guard in the city, all of us must carry out a higher mission. There will come a day when you must make your own choice. Do you understand? Yeah, she's making it right now. A higher mission? <laughs> it is too early, Branya. Still too early. You will understand when the time is right. <gasps> Who's up there? Who are you? The city is drowning in tears. The power of the oh, screenshot. She is real. Kakolia <laughs> um, abandoned preservation. Yes, but we have no right to judge. The fragmentum had been expanding for the past 700 years. There is no faith, nor wealth left for our successors. Only despair. To see the home we vow to preserve wither away. That in itself is torture. Not to mention the haunting whisper of temptation. The day will come when even the strongest of wills Cannot help but give in to such influence. It is only a matter of time before the Amber Lord forsakes us. Mm, then let others carry on the will of preservation. You. You are but a stranger to us. And yet. You seek to bond. 
your destiny to ours. So be it. What is there to lose when so much has Oh my god, guys, am I upgrading from the bat? And I'm gonna get an actual sword? Oops, I didn't let her finish. I must walk towards it. RP. It's very much slower. It is farther away than I anticipated. It's too late, we're committed now. Surely we don't have to go right up to it, right? It'll just activate. <laughs> Whatever, I like, okay, thank goodness, okay. <laughs> seeing us literally die. Yeah, they're doing fine. Their first trailblazer mission. They'll remember this forever. Take it. <gasps> yes, I don't have a stupid stinky bat anymore. I hope. Oh my god, guys, I'm getting chills. Uh... Yes, one time speed. It can't be. The will of preservation has made its choice. Okay. The music kind of loud, though. <laughs> This is the default. We are doomed to destruction. Walking hand in hand into the darkness. No, that end won't come to pass while we're around. The brave new world. Stay alert. Okay, an ally is currently being locked on. Please, please use the other skill. What if I don't? This new skill can taunt enemies and draw attacks from. Indestructible. Do you have answers? Let's test your knowledge. Fail. Get out. Wow, well, that really is a very slow. And play for a while. Naughty children. Magnuel is accumulated when Neota is attacked. Consume four stacks of Magnuel will to enhance basic attack. Okay. Oh, and it's fire Body damage now too, instead of physical. Oh, yeah. Never stop thinking. Zero points. Next. Don't worry, I'll go eat. For a shot. Next time. Oh no, it's activated again. Okay, the engine of creation is activated. Use it to destroy Lance of the Eternal Fruit. Oh wait, I command that? Hell yeah. An ally target's action can charge the engine of creation to a this event. Wait, what did it say? Let's test your knowledge. Anyone charges it? Fail. Get out. Mediocre. I know the music's like intense. Can you find the answer? Why don't you stay? Say and us, play for a while. Knowledge is the measure of all things. It reveals truth and falsehood. Lance of Blaze! <gasps> what is this? Lady oh, Lance! What 
them. Zero points. Next. Don't I have like two of these to go through though? Is it only skills that, um... It's only skills that increase the R, right? Actually, Hiroshima is a single enemy, right? Never stop thinking. Heal people. Cause that's the only way that I'm gonna like. It's the only skills that up the like the R thing right now. Um, 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 what should I be using right now? Such a sick ass character design on this map, though. This doesn't kill me, but I have a. Uh, let's just let's just talk some people off. Power of the Stellaron is with me. The power of the Stellaron is with me. I hope it consumes you, bitch. We made a choice, you are but cinders of the old world, soon to become ashes. Be the architect of a new world. Okay, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Oh no, we're still going. We are still going. I'm asking the questions. Well, let's just, just use time. this. Top just everyone off against oh, that was a baby shot. Think nothing of it. Not bad. Five points. Let's see this so sick. <laughs> what the? Don't worry. I'll 
Oh my god, I lost my cursor. It's giving very Final Fantasy vibes, like... I feel like I'm at the end of an expansion right now. And this is just one planet? No, let her die. You know there was no way of saving her, Bronia. She's not even your real mom. I'm just gonna... That's rude. That's mean. Her mom just died. She doesn't even go here. Mother, did you wake up from that dream? No, I think she was dreaming until the very end. Wow. That was a tough trailblazing expedition. We made it! But, uh, what are we gonna do with the Stellaron? It's usually Mr. Yang who handles it. I've informed Himiko and Mr. Yang already. They'll steal the Stellaron. Is no one gonna, like, offer Bronia some, like, comforting words, though? Like, right to business. Well, who's gonna handle the Stellaron? Whoa, whoa. Nice! The crisis on this world is basically over, right? The storm still rages on. Now that the Stellaron is sealed, the eternal freeze will slowly recede. The fragmentum won't aggressively expand anymore, but nor will it disappear. Eurelo 6 has a chance to return to life, but it will <laughs> take time. Noodle, wow, what an adventure! What a first trailblazing expedition! It will depend on the efforts of the people here. Let the storm rage on, indeed. Thank you. Okay, well, she doesn't seem too torn up about it. I mean, she looks fine. Who would reply with this option? Can't think of anything funny to say. That's so mad. Don't be too hard on yourself. Thank you. I'm, I'm fine. Don't worry. There is still much to do. The people will have felt the effects of the engine of creation. There are so many questions to answer, so many truths to reveal. I don't know whether I can get the people to accept all this. Tell everyone the truth. Can I really do that? Your mom literally just lied to everyone for like years. Tell everyone about mother's true motives? About a lie perpetrated for 700 years? No. No. No way. Zila, I... 
I don't know how to explain it, but I don't think there's any other way. In the underworld, we tell the kids, things will be better tomorrow. Everyone knows it's a lie, but it gets them to sleep with some hope. Can you imagine the consequences if we told the people what happened here? They'd be devastated. If we can't trust So you just want to keep lying to people? That doesn't seem very trustworthy. Trust? Mother died to preserve Bellabop. What? The visitors from beyond the sky told her the secret of the Stellaron. She knew that Alyssa Rand, the first Supreme Guardian, had failed to destroy it. And yet, she decided to challenge its power. A, a power beyond human comprehension. Supreme Guardian Kokolia sacrificed herself to dispel the dark clouds enveloping this city. From here on out, that's the truth. Damn, she thought of that real here. fucking quick. What do you think? It keeps the hope of preservation alive, at least. It's logical and hard to disprove. Why do we have to lie? I'm abstaining. I like telling the truth. We know that, March. But I get we know what that. you're trying to do. <laughs> you like to tell the truth, all right. Um, I'll say I agree. Let's use this version. Thank you for understanding. For many people, Mother was an outstanding guardian. The whole truth will live on in my mind. All the mistakes. Madness, evil. Dreams therein. I will be the one to carry that burden. Now, I must take over the duties of the Supreme Guardian. And discard my naive fantasies. <laughs> oh, Margie, precious bean, right? <laughs> I'm sorry, Sila. Please protect this secret with me. Yeah, this story is way better than Genshin's. Lives. I don't even know. Dude, the story in Genshin's was so I guess lame that I don't even I literally don't remember anything of it. <laughs> Say no more. I know what to do. It definitely didn't give me the feels like this did. Thank you. Well then. As promised. What story in Genshin? Building the bridge between the overworld and the underworld. I don't even know how far I got, Fudge. That's why I couldn't even tell you. Like, that sounds like something far into the future of Genshin that I did not get to. <laughs> but I don't like I don't like games where it's like Zila, when people say you like tell everyone in the underworld that the Stellaron has been sealed. Like with Monster Hunter, like when I had friends with, over. I hadn't played Monster and Hunter and they wanted me to play it, they're like, oh yeah, you have to play like 30 hours before the game starts getting fun. And I'm like, why the fuck should I have to sink 30 hours into a game before it gets fun? Like, that's a lot of time. <laughs> Tell them the blockade will soon be over. Of course. Leave it to me. Nat's probably getting anxious about the delay. While you do that, I'll head back to the... Administrative district, I need to tell Jabard and serve. Huh. Okay. Are you okay? Maybe they learned. <laughs> What's wrong, Branya? Do you feel sick? I'm I'm fine. I need to I need to hurry. Hurry where? Oh, she's what? exhausted. Quick, we need to think of something. Uh, you help me out here. I have a name. Um well, mm. they should be together. They're lesbians. Forgot. I'm just They're gonna so wanted by the guards. But I want their love to blossom. They're so cute there. together. Look at, at them. They don't stand out as much as you guys. Let's settle then. I'll leave not to you. Remember to keep the secret. For Brun. No. <laughs> oh. Look how cute they are. They had a moment at the orphanage, okay? So, wanna tell us what happened back there? Don't think you can just reappear on the battlefield with a cool weapon in your hands and I was gonna ask about that. Can I? Do I still get that weapon? Um, I, I saw the uh, belt. You drew the Amber Lord's gaze right at that moment. That's too much of a coincidence. 
She probably doesn't know what happened either. This wouldn't be the first time. Something similar happened when we faced the Doomsday Beast on the space station. All eyes on me! Remember that glance from Nanook? I'm amazing! Originally, we thought it was because the Stellaron was linked to the destruction. But now it seems to be more than that. We might need to speak with Mr. Yang to understand what's going on. Let's focus on the business at hand first. We shouldn't disrupt Himiko and Mr. Yang while they're dealing with the Stellaron. Let's talk once we're back on the Express. Mm, you're right. We need to finish what we started. Let's hurry up and find Natasha. What did I do? What is this? It's beautiful. Oh my god, okay. Yes. <gasps> and change my path. What? <gasps> what? Okay, well, I'll put her back. Just because I have everything. So, so we're just gonna, like, collect them, basically? So we can literally be, like, any fucking... We're literally, like... We can just adjust to the team's comp. Like, I was so worried about having two physical people, and now it's like, well, that doesn't even matter anymore. <gasps> Because I can be anything I want. Hi, Cypher! Hello, hello! How are you? We did it! Okay, where are we going? Um, actually, do we need to heal? We did. Let's go over here real quick. Is there anything else in this world before I leave? Okay, it's somewhere that we can come back to. Okay, we'll leave it then. Um... Look, there's a big crowd Good, the thank clinic. God. Oh, Dung was calling me. Natasha, Oleg. Sorry, Dung. You didn't have to wait too long. Oh, it's them. You kids move fast. By the look on your faces, I assume you come bearing good news. Mm -hmm. Did you not feel you the, the, the planet might not go back to normal? This, but we summoned up all our strength and then... <laughs> uh, maybe she should do the talking. I'm no good at serious stuff. I'll probably say something I'll regret. The Guardian sacrificed herself to seal the Sephora. Yes, that's the lie we're going with. <laughs> We were there at the fight. We witnessed everything. Uh, sacrificed herself, huh? Sure, yeah, that's March, the whole shut up. story. shut up! What are you doing? Uh, Kakolia, in order to save Bellabog, She's like she... sabotaging. So the massive tremors we felt earlier were a result of the battle, right? Thank you. I can't even imagine what you've been through up there. I'm just glad everything turned out all right. What about Zila? Don't worry, she's all right. It took a big toll on Branya, so Zila took her over to the guards. Oh, good. I'm so glad you're all okay. Now that Kokolia is no more, I guess our Silvermane girl is about to become the next Supreme Guardian? Hmm. Yeah, that you've already made friends with. She sees things through, and doesn't go back on her word. The Underworld will thrive again under her watch. Mm-hmm. Oh, we brought you a message from Branya. <clears throat> the blockade will soon be lifted. The people of the Underworld will breathe freely. Oh my god, Zero. Yeah, I was thinking the exact same thing. Also, Cypher, thank you for the follow. Oh, but we're getting so many. I feel like we've gotten 30 followers in like the last five days. Breathe freely. We're climbing on up. Maybe we'll hit a thousand this year. All along. Probably not. March, Don Hung, and you. That's a lot of people. Can I ask for your help again? I want to get this news out to everyone. It'll lift their spirits and bring them hope. <gasps> Kelsen. Thank you. Choose whoever you like. Wildfire will take care of the rest. We've gotten to know a lot of Underworlders. 
Who do you think we should start with? Yeah, you're uh, I met you at Ray's community nights. I see you on every so often. Well, when I'm checking the website, I, I only really go, come on, one day a week now. Um, oh my god. Who is Gertie? Oh, is she the hotel staff lady? Let's go to her. Hmm, roger that. You can leave the rest to us. If everything goes smoothly... Maybe I should have picked someone different. <laughs> This should be Wildfire's final mission. Why is everyone in such a hurry? I hope nothing's happened at the hotel. We should take a look. Maybe we can help. Wait, let's figure out what Dong wants. Oh god. Um, not bad. That's great. Listen, Yoda, our friendship began from our fight. What? We're friends? Since when? After the battle with you folks, I have meticulously examined the security of the restricted zone. I think it's time to hold a massive military exercise to raise the new recruits' vigilance and defensive awareness. So... Why are you telling me this? Oh, I would like to invite you to be the main drill master and host this military exercise at the Silver Main Guard restricted zone. That sounds like a lot of work. Please, Neota, the onions and the Silver Main Guards needs your, your guidance uh, whenever you have the time. Okay. Uh. I don't want to help him. He smells. I see Gertie, but who's that lying on the ground? Quick, let's head over. Joshua. Oh my, this doesn't look good. Can you hear me? Are you okay? He's still breathing. Try not to panic on Gertie. Is everything okay? Wait, isn't that Peak? Don't tell me he fell asleep in the middle of the road again. Oh, it's you three. Back in the underworld so soon? Word must have gotten out that I was renovating the hotel today. Being the kind-hearted young man that he is, Pete came straight over and offered to help. There we were hard at work when all of a sudden the hotel started shaking. I got everyone outside as fast as I could, but I think Peak was hit by a ceiling tile. Oh, rip. Love the new model. Thank you. Yeah, I had a... My friend Catnaps made it. She made my previous, like, chibi model of my casual version, but now that I have my actual design from Inozo, she made me this little chibi model while she works on my 2D, like, my bigger 2D model. <laughs> Are you sure he was hard at work? Seems like he's coming around. Huh? Peek, are you awake? Oh, thank goodness you- Okay, I'm gonna kind of read through this. Having such a great nap. Are you okay, bro? Let me take you to Natasha's clinic. Lying. Look where he's lying. It's, it's an old photo. I thought I lost this ages ago. How did it get- Aunt Gertie, isn't that you in the photo? And old Goethe, too. You look so young. What do you mean she is young? What? Don't I know it. My distant cousin had only just taken over the family business at the time. He wrote me a letter inviting me to head up and take a look. It's been nearly 20 years already. Damn. I remember chatting in the hotel lobby and drinking tea. I wonder if we'll ever get another chance to do that. You know, we've got some good news for you. Oh my god, don't spill a march. Is that true? Ronya, she... I... I can't believe my ears. Put your faith in Bronia. <laughs> now she's in her 30s, right? I don't know right? what to say. <laughs> Turns out things aren't always lost forever. It feels like better days are finally on the horizon. Thank you all so much for coming to tell me the good news. I haven't felt like this in a long time. We'll get plenty of guests staying at the hotel again once the passageway is open. But there's no way I'm letting them set eyes on this old place looking like this. Oh, and we're gonna need to expand the menu. Oh dear. Action stations! Action stations? Already? Uh, um, uh, oh, ow! Oh, my, my head! Please, let Dr. Natasha know not to worry. We're all okay. You three will have to come and stay again once the hotel is fully renovated. We will. Oh. 
What is this? A message? Uh, <laughs> the ceiling of the stellar is complete and the spatial distortion is dissipating. Good job. We should be back soon. Don't rush. Go at your own pace. The express will be here before you're ready to leave. Great. I'm craving some juice. Pom Pom still owes me a glass. How's your real six? Not great. Even though the influence... Oh wait, yeah, that's six. Of the Celeron has basically subsided. The existing fragmentum is too deeply rooted. The eternal freeze has lasted a very long time, enough to severely impact the ecology of the planet. In short, the planet probably won't regain the vitality that it once had a thousand years ago in such a short time. How could this be? Is there anything else we can do? As trailblazers, our mission has already concluded successfully. The fate of this world should be handed back to its inhabitants. Humankind has always struggled against austere conditions and had always managed to, th to thrive in spite of it. Now that the eternal freeze is gone, the... Oh, stop. Oh my god, stop. Okay. <laughs> um, the fragments <laughs> fragmentum has lost its momentum to expand. Real 06 will be revitalized, believe in the perseverance of her people. I detected a high-frequency spatial energy surge in the north of Real 06. You might be interested in checking it out. Don't worry, the energy is not related to the Stellaron. It's only an echo left behind after spatial disorders fade away. Inside the echo are perceptions of space and time that we use to will become radically altered, to the point where it might even reconstruct certain scenes from our own past experiences. If you're in the mood and wish to relive those memorable adventures, you can try your luck at places where echoes can be found. Okay. Oh, Mr. Yang put it nicely, but the reality is this: we sealed the Stellaron, but that's yeah, not going to solve the problem in that group chat. Planet. There, I was getting excited to tell everyone the good news. Well, it's pretty cute. Kenny texted me good morning. <laughs> um, we did that's make a the promise. the cruelty of a Stellaron. Still, compared with some of the other planets we visited, at least this one has hope. Damn. So, should we tell everyone the deal? We should tell Branya when the time's right. Let's not dampen the spirit just yet. Okay, review past memories of about. Okay, click it. Oh. Open the interstellar peace guide. Well, putting out plus 99 Discord notifications, right? Ooh. Ooh, you can get light cones. Ooh. Oh, there's like rewards. Okay. Return to Natasha. Where are you at, girl? Hello, I lovely. wish you all a journey that is free of illness. That's not what you said. I hope your explor exploration will make progress, Nyota, and your journey will be free of pain. Of course, even if you get injured by accident, no need to panic. Just leave it to the doctor. Doctor oh, Natasha, we're is back. Is everyone all right? Thanks for your help. Uh, for you, anything. <laughs> I'm flattered. <laughs> now we just have to wait for the official news. I hope Rania doesn't keep us too long. Huh. Do you think Sparog and Clara felt the effects of our battle with the Guardian? I think they'll be fine. Plus, Svarog's devotion to Clara is even greater than his hostility to wildfire. <laughs> yes. If you're worried, you could look for them over at the robot settlement. I am. She's cute. Oh my god, look how many freaking quests I have. I don't really have that many quests. Woo. Hello, Timmy. Outsiders. No, Perkins. Friends of Clara. Perkins. How did you know that was Perkins? The, the, the. Seems like Perkins picked up a stammer. Its language module must have malfunctioned. Please get her some shoes. Is she still Can over there shoeless? The Outsiders are fruitful. Bring us. Nope, that's too slow. Oh, this is what I <laughs> He was cheering me on for when I went to do the fight. 
You have visitors, Clara. The other one's like, clap your ass. Oh, it's the variables. Another nickname for the collection. There was a huge shaking just now coming up through the ground. Mr. Sparrow said it must have been... Recalculating. Conclusion. Engine of creation. 97.66% probability. Old friend of yours. <laughs> the engine of creation was an immense construction machine created by the architects. It was not built to fight. Well, I used it to fight, well, all right. whatever. <laughs> we won. Thanks to that Kinsel's giant robot, me. we were finally able to take care of the Stellaron. And Branya made a promise. The underworld and the overworld will soon be reunited. Which means that you, Sparog, um, you won't have to worry about preserving the underworld for the time being. March, everyone, thank you so much. I wasn't sure you guys would be able to do it, but... But now... Mr. Sparrow, what do you say? You guys said you were travelers she from other the worlds, She's so right? Cute. I want to be just like you. One Come day, with us. Come to my party. To Let me steal you away. Let me put some shoes on you. Friends. Let's cover those grippers. Calculation result. Update. Mission number 0001. Preserve the underworld. Complete. Damn, that might have concealed the grippers, yeah. Conceal, don't feel. Let your sin run with the tangled song. She's part of your main team? Hell yeah. Are you seeing this? This android can actually send messages? Wait, what? Your taste in stickers, what the fuck? How do you feel physically? Thanks to Zila, I'm fine now. Thank goodness I've already given the orders to the Silverman guards to immediately lift the blockade between the overworld and the underworld, and some people in the underworld should have already received the notice. After closing for more than a decade, the cable car station should finally be reopening soon. If you don't mind, I would like you to come to the overworld for my succession ceremony. Woohoo, we wouldn't miss it for the universe. See you there, hee hee. <laughs> See you there. <laughs> That's our Bronya. Quick as a flash. <laughs> oh, and this treasure. She certainly moves a lot faster than some people I know. Meet up with the treasure. Haven't... God, are we almost off this planet already? It's Get me back to the train. Where to now? You made it. <laughs> I thought you were about to miss out on a moment. Oh my goodness, thank you. I was shrimp in there. No way. After all our hard work, how could we miss out on the final celebration? Right? I'll go sit at the children's table. <laughs> I smell it too. For Oleg and I, not to mention the other adults, reopening the passageway means rediscovering old ways of living uh, return to normality <laughs> but for the children who were born into this era who grew up in this yeah they're gonna go up there and be like what the fuck? <laughs> this will be a new life altogether once you've tasted freedom it's difficult to accept a life of separation and isolation those of us whose childhoods were marred by tragedy we must strive to do better for the next generation I'm sorry. Here I am talking your ear off again. <clears throat> this is a day to remember. We should welcome it with smiles. <sighs> if you have time, talk to the folks here. Every one of them will tell you about... Finally. Oh. Finally, I can get back to supervising the cable cars. I thought I'd spend the rest of my life in those mines. Ah, it's you! The liberators of the underworld. You're the first passengers we've had since being sealed off. <laughs> It'll be my honor to get you to the surface in one piece. Where's Sampo? Oh, uh, I'm afraid you might have to make an exception, miss. 
My license has expired, but then I haven't had the chance to go up and renew it for ten years now. <clears throat> so, ready to climb aboard? <laughs> no problem. Oh. This car. Oh wait, did they want me to go right now? I thought it was just talking to people like a generalized thing. Yeah, I don't fucking care about some of these people. Um. Push it in. Okay, I guess we'll go so, back up. <laughs> ready to climb. Brothers, sisters, ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls car. of all ages, gather around the cable. <laughs> Everyone's the going up. Oh, <laughs> just here. That's not a ceiling hook. That's the sky. So this is Damn. the overworld? They get to see the, the outside. <laughs> Less rust and geomero particles floating around. Uh, Take I only speak breath, English. <laughs> this is what freedom tastes like. I'm sorry. I never thought I'd live to see the administrative district again. All those years. We've been through a lot, Natasha. You're right, Oleg. Yeah, English is my main language. I wish Funny. I knew another language. <laughs> the moment I boarded the cable car, my mind was filled with everything I wanted to do on the surface. But now, I just want to sit down, zone out, and watch the people yeah, come she's going to be out of a job. I'm good. And How let about you? The day just pass me by. We're just progressing the story. Enjoy the peace and quiet, Natasha. We earned it. Oh, what's happening? Huh, it's Jepard. Is he here to meet us? Oh my He's... goodness. Get me off this planet. <laughs> Have you been Yoda? Have you left Bella Bug yet? Um, about to leave. Hopefully. <laughs> We've got other planets to save. Oh, is that so I won't trouble you then? No harm in asking, Chief. I'll be frank, there's something I'd like your help with. So I've only been back on the overworld for a while. My seat is not even warmed up yet, and the Silverman guards are rushing to get me to be their advisor. You've just finished that thing about the Stellaron, and these impatient fools are already, already trying to launch a counteroffensive at the Fragmentum. But if we're talking about the Fragmentum, I think you can, you can, you lot can claim expertise. Another fight. Yeah, the other guy wants me to like train his peep. So, haha, <laughs> kinda. If you're planning to join the offense, go look for the liaison officer named William at the Silvermane Guard Restricted Zone. The fragmentum they wanted to clear is called the Corridor of Fading Echoes. Quite a chilling name, isn't it? But I'm guessing it'll be easy as pie for you. Still on duty. <laughs> oh my goodness, I keep getting more freaking case. More, more quests. Oh my goodness. You must have recovered quickly. Welcome back to the administrative district, Trailblazers. Trailblazers. First time anyone's called us that on this planet. <laughs> We're the, the variables now. I think it's only right that we should address you properly. Outsiders is hardly fitting anymore. Please allow me to apologize again for what happened in the restricted zone. You were only trying to help. I should have trusted Serval's judgment. Thanks for understanding. Lady Branya's inaugural address will begin soon. Wait, what does that She mean? asked me to pass on her invitation to you. Do I want some tacos? <laughs> I use Google Translate. Um, I love tacos and I'm super hungry, so yeah. Uh-huh. That's sooner than I expected. Is she well enough to... Not really. But Lady Branya insisted on delivering the speech as yes. soon as possible. I would she say they the were my favorite food at one point. Happened. The address will be held at Everwinter Monument. I hope the three of you can find time to attend. Um, there's sculptures. Wait, where does this poop me out? Oh, sick, it's right here. <laughs> it used to be. Look, there's a crowd gathering over there. It's got Is meat, cheese, vegetables. 
the, like the taco, so you got the carbs. It's got everything. Mm. Looks like it. Guards, formation. Whoa, <laughs> this must be it. Citizens of Bellabog. Why are we not up front and center? Lady I do like tacos from Taco Bell, yes. Will begin shortly. Please. People of Bellabog, hear me. <laughs> Today we gather here to celebrate our victory, but it was a sacrifice made by a mighty guardian that delivered us this opportunity. She dispelled an evil that cost us 700 years of suffering. And in the process, she paid the ultimate price. The sacrifice of Kokolia Rand ushers in a new chapter. The blizzard beyond the walls will die away, and the offensives of our Silvermain guards will begin to contain the Fragmentum's advance. In the far north, I witnessed with my own eyes the struggle between the late Supreme Guardian and the evil power that sought to destroy us. In her last moments, the Supreme Guardian told me her greatest regret. The Order to seal off the underworld from the overworld. With the passage of time, she gradually came to realize the consequences of that decision. Although tortured with guilt, she could not undo the damage. They don't have real tacos. They're easy to eat if you're on the go though, but for like making them at home. Um, you're gonna get sushi tomorrow? Wait, get where? To here? Like when you're visiting me? Oh, I guess that's pretty soon, isn't it? Someone was talking about Bria tacos. Oh, Bria stuff is fucking good. Wait, what's a flatas? It's a place a few minutes from me. Tacos e tortas. I'm gonna butcher that. I'm not even gonna say that. Also, Sophie, hello! You just go home and miss the good part? No, In her final yeah, moments, we just like She wanted us to mark up. the Stellarons end by reuniting Bellabog. Overworlders The music was fucking killer though. Like, it was so good. I got chills. To get people of the underworld. Oh, look at us over here. I dare not ask for your forgiveness. I now know the reality of your decade of suffering. But I want us to work together. We know that without your perseverance and hard work, Bellabog will not recover its former glory. Oh my god, and the, the seed like, of civilization the will not from be March. preserved. And on that note, I'd like to extend my heartfelt like gratitude taquitos, but to I don't. Oh, the but city. don't think so. Oh, okay. As no, it doesn't. I need to go get the freaking song or whatever it was. We're not aware of their arrival. But it is thanks to them that our world now flourishes with hope. They made me realize that while we remain focused on preserving the ground beneath our feet, we should not forget to look up into the sky. I firmly believe that with the determination of everyone, our world, the world the trailblazers call Yarilo Six, will no longer be alone among the stars. But before we accomplish that goal, I humbly ask you to follow me into the future. I, Branya Rand, the 19th guardian of Bellabog, hereby take my oath. Lady Branya! Lady Branya! We did it. Oh my goodness, no, it never ends, guys. It never ends. Ooh, does she just. No, she Branya, didn't we're back! March. Don Hung, and you. It's wonderful you made it to the address. I mean, where else would we be? <laughs> Sorry, I know the invitation was very last minute, but I needed to get the news out as soon as possible. The longer people waited, the more rumors started to swirl. The situation risked spinning out of control. <laughs> Indeed, rude, right? <laughs> Are you fully recovered? Yes, I'm fine now, don't worry. Hi, Quinn! Hello, hello. My mother, she tried to force the voice of the Stellaron into my head. It was a terrible feeling. I, I don't know what would have happened you, if you had I believe in you, Bronya. You would have, you would have fought through it. That was some speech, Bronya. If I had to talk like that in front of a huge crowd, 
I'd be shaking head to toe. Would you though, Marge? You literally like just talk, 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 talk. It's all just a bunch of palatable lies. <laughs> How are you, Gwen? I hope you never have a similar experience, March. <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> um. I know, right? <laughs> I prefer to be honest with the people. But I also want to preserve their hope. Don Hung, wanna talk about Mr. Yang's findings? Yeah, of course March doesn't want to talk about that. It's boring. <laughs> Allow me to explain. Fade to black. Yeah, sorry, you guys got work to do on your planet. <laughs> Which means... The Fragmentum has already taken root by this point. Even though the Stellaron is sealed, we won't be able to reverse the damage immediately. Uh, sorry, we promised you. No, no need for apologies. You've gone out of your way to save this world. You nearly lost your life. I have no right to ask for more. Besides, just another day being the I main agree character. With Mr. Yang. Ultimately, the fate of Bellabog is in the hands of its own people. Um, the Astral Express will do everything in our power to help. Sorry, guys. I speak case, on behalf of it now, I guess. As a leader, I must give you a promise of the same weight. We will hold out with everything we have until the day you trailblazers return. Even if it takes another 700 years. The children of Yarilo Six will look up to the sky with hope in their hearts. So long, my friends. May the preservation bless your journey. Damn, we did Congrats. it. Congrats! That was one heck of a first trailblazing expedition. Yeah, are they all this Worth badass? celebrating, I'd say. On a scale of one to five, how would you rate this journey? Oh. What? That run of the mill, huh? That was run of the mill. My scoring criteria are. Different from yours. Uh, anyway, we should be asking you. Any what will the next Equally adventure be like? I'm sure. Anyway, don't worry about the future. Live in the moment. Let's go for one more round in the administrative district. I want to take more photos. Oh my god, girl. What is this? Uh, Planner Ornaments. Provides the wearer with various special stats. Gain bonus buffs if the wearer has a complete set equipped. Is this not the same as relics? Oh my goodness. Oh, it is. Oh, okay. Enter. Okay. I don't even know who I'm equipping this on right now. Oh, on me. Okay. Am I the only one that can use those? No, everyone can. Okay. Oh my god, she wants me to go. Now we have to take pictures. Don Hung is disappointed because his boyfriend is with you. Wait, who's his boyfriend? Oh god, what have I unlocked? Okay, we go to that later. Why is there like... Why won't it not say new anymore? That bothers me. Don Hung, how long can humans live? Here we are! Everwinter Mo- Oh, Kayla and Hook are here too! Let's be- Um... Much so in the photos once we're done. Okay. What am I taking a photo of? Just this? Um, how far back do I have to be? Oh, I just take it. I'm an idiot. I don't know why I was waiting for it to like load up or something. I don't want to spoil who's boy. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, don't spoil, don't spoil. But it's warm here. Aren't you overworlders worried it'll melt? Not at all. It may look like ice. But it's actually a monument carved out of Geomero crystal. Ah, oh, Geomero! It's a shame Daddy isn't here. 
You find a buyer for it and sell it for big bucks. Uh, how do I explain? This particular <laughs> piece of geomancy is, is not his. <laughs> not for sale. I took a photo. I must remind you that taking photos. Okay, wait. shut up. Wow, photo. <laughs> you like it? Okay, where to next? Oh my god. Oh, we haven't seen Sir Ball since Could she not back? do this by her fucking Let's self? Head to the like. <laughs> Who's there? <You're... laughs> it's you three. How okay, you she's talking to Claire about me. Miss Sir Ball's workshop is a meek. I like Sir it here Ball. a lot. Clara is such a well mannered kid. Meanwhile, the architect's children are still calling me auntie and making me feel old. Let's take a photo, photo together. <laughs> this feels like one of photo. Over here. Okay, I'm just kind of like speed reading through that because I want to get off this fucking planet already. Wow, that's pretty great. I wish the photo. Uh huh? Am I really that short? Yeah, Don't you have no worry. shoes on. <laughs> if you eat like Don Hung, you'll be as tall as him one day. Uh, I'll... Here, keep it. Huh? I understand. Th what? Thanks, Miss Serval. Big sister, if you have time. Oh, we will. I will be back. Oh, uh, that's enough sightseeing Shit, two photos. photos taking to last me a while. Time to head back to the Goethe Hotel for a good night's sleep. We can sleep when we're back on the express. That's just the exact same, but with not <laughs> so fast. <laughs> with Last some type of shoe. Here, that evil Madam Guardian interrupted us before we'd gotten the most out of our luxury suites. Don't oh yeah, she's so short, but she's so cute. It? Come on, Kimiko and Mr. Yang are grown-ups. I'm sure they'll cope without the sides. Don't you want to chit-chat with the no, locals? No, I want to go back on the fucking express to the next planet. Again? I'm gonna go to a cooler planet. Like, what the heck is the next planet gonna look like? Maybe Gertie will be up here. <gasps> she is! She specifically doesn't like shoes, so probably. Oh. Oh. Why doesn't she like shoes? Go to bed. The engine of creation, Kokolia, and Ethereal Outer Space, the gaze of preservation. Your fragmented memory of the battle forms a blurry and surreal montage. In the midst of this frantic tapestry of events, you can see the moment Kokolia perished with the Stellaron. A strange voice speaks to you in a hushed tone, but the voice passes rapidly. You try to recall what you saw in those fleeting moments, but find no trace. All of a sudden, you hear it again a female voice in At your ear. At the end of your journey, all that perplexes Skafka. you and troubles you Skafka. will result. It's my mother. Oh, oh it's Sambo. It I was wondering where he went. Thing, all right. Good thing it dawned on me. Hey, Sampo doesn't have to be a protagonist, right? <laughs> the likes of us are better suited to uh, shadowy comic relief, huh? There's like a Claire fan club in Bellabog that sends her shoes every month and she just goes, no. <laughs> <laughs> Turns out the Astral Express crew is more fun than I expected. Wait, who's he talking to? <laughs> you, you liked it? Really? <laughs> Told you so. No, no. I'm in no hurry to leave. <laughs> uh, what? Oh, Epsilon? <laughs> What fun can you get out of a giant vanity fair like that? <laughs> True happiness always entails No one talks so slow in real life for eight. Like, I swear to goodness, voice actors now, talk so that's slow. A quote I live by. Maybe I just talk fast. Well, I don't know. bye for now. Send my regards to the guys and girls in the tavern. Oh, and don't forget to say that Sampo Kuski will catch them for the next Why one. Why does he remind me of Kronk Time from Emperor's New Groove? To make my curtain call. To you, my dear audience. Oh, he's breaking I the fourth wall. I dedicate ball. my performance. I wonder, did I bring a little more joy into your lives? <laughs> you don't have to answer that. But if the answer is no, then you'll break my heart. I just want to yell at them, Maria. Facts. We should be getting back to the express. Time to find March and Dan Hung. 
Yoda, Mark Chung, how was your rest? Pom Pom has completed the routine pre-departure inspection, so the Nameless is ready to move on to the next world. Come back to the Express when you've tied up all loose ends. All oh, right, you must have so many questions about that final battle with the Supreme Guardian Bellabog. Well, and I made some simple analysis that might help shed some light on it for you. Got it. We'll start our preparations now. Um, does that mean like, are we done that part of the story? I guess like this is. Or does it just keep going along this one linear path? Um... Good morning! How did you sleep? I'm full of energy oh, myself. Uh, just so it's clear. Um, I dreamed about Sam. Oh. Thing. I'll go check the did you get Himiko's message? It's time to go. Uh, yeah, okay. yeah. Let's go, let's go. Bid farewell to Bilabag. Well, if I could just teleport there. Now I'll finally be able to open the gate. Oh no, we're gonna get run over. Here we are at last. <sighs> Nothing lasts forever. <laughs> You'll stop feeling sad the moment you set foot on the express. Where are her legs? <laughs> oh, did you just see them like phase into existence? Hey, I'm not that heartless, you know. Okay. Priorities. What do you mean? <gasps> are you saying rebuilding the underworld isn't Wait, one of what? your priorities? Of course not. I I'm just saying we have limited assets and we need new parameters. Assets, parameters. You <gasps> sure love your first fancy fight. words. Ugh, forget it. Leave it to me. I'll go down myself. <gasps> Come on, Sila. I won't leave you. Look, Ranya. <sighs> There'll be plenty of difficulties waiting for them, right? Yes, their future is filled with even more uncertainty than ours. But we will prevail here, even if it means arguments like this go on forever. <laughs> they won't go on forever if I win them. Welcome home, you three. Himeko, Mr. Yang! Team Trailblaze, back from duty! Mission one accomplished. Although Welt and I didn't get the chance to go with you, I can tell you worked hard to bring things back to normal. Well done, everybody. And especially you. I heard a lot of good things They're about so you. They're so adorable. How would you rate my performance? I got kicked out. It's a solid five stars. Get some rest on the Express. Your Relo 6 was not an easy ride. Pom Pom is of the opinion that we should leave as soon as possible to avoid potential resurgences of the anomalies we experienced earlier. Himiko and I agree. Which means we need to decide where our next destination is soon. That's right. That's the path of the nameless, I presume. Always on the road, always trailblazing. Uh, I'm not complaining, by the way. One adventure after another? That's exactly what I signed up for. <laughs> Looks like March has fallen in love with the way of the nameless. That's good to hear. You can head back to your rooms for some rest. Or stay here and make yourselves a cup of coffee. Whichever you like. I'll head back to my room then. <sighs> there I was thinking this guy would gradually open up. We need to give him some time, March. I think he treasures the time spent with you. He guys. had fun, even though he wasn't in my party. About your battle against the Supreme Guardian and the whole Stellaron situation, you must have a lot of unanswered questions, I suppose. While you were away, Weld and I did some research and came to some interesting conclusions. Let me know if you want to ask about anything. Ah, home sweet home. Mr. Yang and Himeko must be bored given how long our The express crew tread upon the trailblaze. We travel between worlds like a threat the universe okay, is talk vast so beyond our imagination. It's a miracle that our paths converge. The fact that we get no, to know tell me about the fucking becoming our companion. 
Um, I love it. Sure. Yeah, the spittle. Oftentimes, those who are involved in historic events don't have the opportunity to see things from a wider perspective. I hope as an onlooker, I may provide some help. Um... Klopoth the Preservation is known for their... indifference. Unless you become a zealot like those with the corporation, it's hard to share in the Eon's power. Determined to preserve the world they loved, the architects held on for hundreds of years. But as the Fragmentum continued to advance, their already wavering faith started to show some cracks. And one particular guardian, Kokolia, abandoned the path of preservation altogether. In contrast, you stood your ground and proved your faith in the Amber Lord. Judging by how the battle turned out, Klopoth responded to your wish. Their gaze infused you with the power to wield the weapon of a supreme guardian and to take control of the Colossus. Um, I was meant to thank you for your support during the battle. <laughs> Don't mention it. Welt and I may have stayed on the Express this whole time, but we've been watching over you from the moment you set foot on Eurelo 6. Friends look after each other. The same goes for us nameless. Please remember, no matter where you are in the universe, the Express will always be behind you. The power it is of a stellar power. There's no doubt about that. What I've gathered so far suggests it's likely that the Supreme Guardian was corrupted by the Stellaron at a very young age. All the tragedies that came after can be traced to that point. On the flip side, we can't judge Kokolia too harshly. Imagine if it were you or me who had to sit on the throne and watch the city slowly being brought to its knees. Would we not question what we believed in? Sure, ask away. We and you really just looks to go back to what it was like well, before the Well, maybe better equipped to answer that. But if you want my two cents, I'd say it's unlikely. I guess it's possible, but it would take a long time. I can tell from your report that the new Supreme Guardian of Bellabog is a smart young lady with leadership qualities. What's more important is that she now understands her people after the journey with you. The firm and honest support she gets from people around her will also prove immensely useful. But faith is kind of like though, people. right? <laughs> Even if during their lifetime they manage to make Eurelo 6 prosper again to a certain degree, they will remain vulnerable and helpless to countless threats lurking in the recesses yeah, of the fine. universe. She's got we this like Greek goddess aura about far. her, kind of. Uh, what it's happened to the Stellaron? It's virtually impossible to destroy a Stellaron. No one, not even Herda, has found a way to break its structure. The best we can do at this stage is to prevent its energy from overflowing. When the Supreme Guardian was defeated, the Stellaron that had been transmitting energy to her exposed its weakness to us for a brief period of time, allowing Welt and I to contain its power. That's about all we can do about a Stellaron. It may be suppressed for now, but it's only a matter of time before it regains power. But this brief window should allow the people on this planet to heal and rebuild. Thank You're you. most welcome. Oh my god, I've talked to him too, Jesus Christ. Checking. Give me rewards, give me them, give me them. Oh, I actually didn't level up that much, okay. Um, wait, I want to check. We didn't get any more, like... Damn, I want more of these little things. Curses! The edible knocked so, out for like two hours. First Damn. first trailblazing expedition has concluded. How do you feel? Yeah, welcome to the land of the living. Be it joy or pain, success or regret, it's all part of the journey. Those feelings will accompany you as long as you tread on the trailblaze, and one day you'll grow used to them. It seems you have something on your mind. Let's hear it. I'd like to hear a fresh perspective myself. Uh, <laughs> as talkative <laughs> as Himiko is, we've pretty much run out of topics. I have returned. Norman called me. Poor dude sounds all, no. Oh. Oh my god. The Fragmentum and the Eternal Freeze. Will they disappear? I'm, as I've mentioned before, the Stellaron's influence on Eurelo 6 is more profound than we might think. Never mind. Don't text me. Good morning. I don't morning. think Wait, why fight against the lingering effects of the Stellaron <laughs> will end anytime soon. <laughs> But it's changed out. The balance of power is tilting ever so slightly towards humanity. The crucial factor being the hope you brought about. As intangible as it may sound, don't underestimate hope. 
because the power it inspires has no limit. Like the Stellaron, it's a seed. Yeah, I'm gonna speed read ahead. I relate your review to the Sarlacc. That's what Sarlacc. That I think so? you did the right thing. And better well, you. I remember a distant world where the people were. This planet. goes cool. to show how much of a difference. This mission would have been much easier if you were there. I too wish to. I've been observing yeah, what's happening on the ground from the express, and I got sweaty palms a couple times. That I got sweaty palms a couple times. He's giving philosophy. I was glad Professor to see you three neat friends you could trust <laughs> and overcome hardships. Well done. Himiko was calm from the very beginning, <laughs> and likewise. Nice chatting with you. Okay, okay. Well, we're gonna end the Honkai Star Rail there, um, just because that was a lot, and it's been like four hours. Um, let me go back to just chatting for a second here. I'm just on just chatting while I change things because now. I want to watch all the trailers for the characters. I don't know if anyone else wants to do that. Am I okay to watch that on stream? I'm not going to get like copyrighted or anything, will I? <laughs> will I? Will I? Will I? Um... Will I? Will I? Will I? Okay. Well, we'll go back to game regular and then... Um... I think this would be display capture. Yeah, okay, you guys can see this, right? I have to go clean up the kitchen if I... Yeah, no worries. If you do, then it was nice knowing you. I'm sure I'll be fine. Yeah, I wanted to watch all of them. So L, you might find another bachelor in here, but I think we start from the bottom, right? Yeah, because March would have been the first and Sparkle's the latest, so. How do I get these like to not autoplay? How do I get it to play in the opposite direction? Um, I don't want to start at the bottom. I want to start at the top. Okay. I don't know how loud this is either. Okay, this is March. Whoa! <laughs> I'm gonna take pictures of everything that's new to new to me. Oh my god, she's so cute though. Hey, wait for me. <laughs> she's so cute. Pom Pom's gonna love this. Hey, over there. It's I hope I get to learn more about her. <laughs> like, who froze her in the first place? You guys came for the snapshot, huh? It's music. Oh, let me know if this is like too loud. This was kind of loud. Is it much louder than I am, I guess? <gasps> Wait, I'm gonna see. Where does it say what's so, next? What do you okay. Think? Uh, hmm, hey, focus. <laughs> Smile. Maybe I'll just keep it like this instead of full screen, so I can click each next one <laughs> without it. So others can suffer the same way she did. Brutal. Oh my god, I never even thought of it that way. It's over. Also, hello, hello, hello. Whoa. What is her thing? Keep up. I move at my own tempo. Is this big enough for you guys to see? Is that good? Is that good? Oh, it's not even like. Let me pause it one second. It's not configured to how I want it. Oopsie.
Genau, genau. Okay. When do the next, like, trailers come out for the people on the next banner? Because I think it was just sparkles. Oh, I want to see this one. This is the girl that I want. Look at her little feet. Look at her tail. Healer Wait, she's a healer? I'm replacing her with Natasha. There's a live stream this weekend? Okay. At least Akron's- Okay, yeah. She's so cute. She's a healer? Sorry, Natasha, you might be replaced once I get this person. This is the guy that I got. Swordsmanship isn't just about maintaining your skills. You they are also the good. Test if you want and yeah, this art is new. so cute. So, if you're not busy today, want to go a few rounds? Waku Cloud Knight Lieutenant Yen Ching, reporting for duty. No matter the opponent, a clash of swords is all I need to get ahead. I'm waiting for the Dark Duration bathtub one. I didn't watch it yet. He's just kind of boring, yeah. I admit I have a girl crush on her. Well, she's cute. She's fucking sick as fuck. Not bad. You did better than most. That's pretty cool, though. That's it for today's practice. Sword sheet. Yeah, he's just kind of basic. Oh, here it is, girl. Here it is, Himiko. You literally just installed her. There are endless possibilities and unknowns among the stars. Our journey is the process One of, of pulling us. apart the threads of possibility of us. to seek the final truth. I am Himiko, the navigator. Oh, Welcome this is to nice. the Astral Express. The Express doesn't have a clear destination, because every passenger's destination is unique. I'm sure we're about to embark on a fascinating journey together. I have something for you. Oh, I love this music. Combat is a series of precise machinations. Oh, she did One it? One at a time. Oh my god, she's giving that one um, Stormblood no exception. raid boss. Trailblazing means that every step the you take is a step closer to the stars. That is my answer. A new trailblazing journey has just begun. Ooh. She asking me out. Oh, we got little Jeppy. I'm a captain of the Silver Main Guard. Yeah, okay. To serve okay, Anduin. the Supreme Guardian is my responsibility and my honor. Bellabog is this planet's last bastion. And the Silver Main Guards are Bellabog's indestructible shield. I'm sorry, it doesn't make us any laugh, like. <laughs> you will know justice! Okay, this music's so epic, though. This ends here. 
by becoming a shield for the people is one worthy of the title architect. Trust must never be betrayed. Hopes must never be squandered. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what's up here? Let yourself fall. Oh my god, is he listening to his sister's music? Oh my god, he was. Servo's guitar case as his weapon. <gasps> Isn't it? Oh my god, see what? Here they come again. Quick, don't let her get away! It's a dead end, she's done! Making trouble on Wildfire's territory? You guys! Got a lot of nerve! Still here? I'm afraid things... just got complicated. She's like a reaper from the back. Sometimes a sharp blade is the only way to get people to come to their senses. Did I ask for your help? Looks like you could use it. Let's make this quick. Don't tell me what to do. There's always a weakness. Now for the one that slipped through the net. Stop holding me back, Overworlder. Is this like a duo trailer, or do we get one specifically for... Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past! Uh, I'm trying to click them before they change. Welcome back, Fancy! Who's this one? Oh, he's on the... Why does he sound like Sambo? So, when he just kind of bathed Silas. Oh god, it doesn't have a room. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Your turn, General. Bold indeed. <sighs> Kids these days. A little too naive. It is a warrior's game. Singular encounters with endless possibilities. So tactical. I think he's got like one of the longest trailers too. Here is thunder. You know, it's not selling me though. This is how to secure victory. Music is kind of fun. Oh. <laughs> What's Time up, for the master stroke. Radiant spirits heed my will. It's interesting how many types of like character designs they have similar to this one. Have you memorized all that? Yes, General. Very good. <gasps> Silver Wolf's next. But only when Silver you've Wolf forgotten next. it will you be ready. What? So then... Huh? Yeah, Tamsi, you heard that too? Okay, I wasn't the only one. <laughs> this is who I want. Hello? For missions, I can do this in my sleep. Whatever. Let's get this over with. The Anti-Matter Legion? Interesting. Let's Walk see. Animation. Just a couple of small fries. But I have it. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't mind an easy mode run. I guess I can play a while. Dude, I want Silver Wolf so bad. Warm ups? 
over. <laughs> Easier than I thought. Why do low levels make the most noise? Want to beat me? <laughs> Come back in a century. During the live stream, the host was very horny for her walk animation oh, down. All done. She just had a reverb chain? Oh my god, my look is so bad. Ooh, I haven't seen this person yet. Luoka? The days and years pass us like the wind. Why is this but one the so warning sad? before the journey still rings in my ears. This one's so sad. Guard your road. Got her on a rerun of a bit salty. Remember one of her best light cones was from an event that's never coming. Out among what? the stars, the undercurrent swells beneath the Maybe tide. Maybe they'll bring it out in a different event? Because that would be like the worst fucking Though FOMO ever if you couldn't get it merchant. anywhere else. I too am bound by rules. That which has been lost will be reclaimed. That which is seized must be repaid. Fear not. Oh, he gave her a little head pat. Eternal sleep is not the end. The dead will return. It's hard for a wanderer to find rest in this world. But I still need a pair of eyes. To witness your promise. What the? Okay, who's Blade? EDM jump scare. Or it should be in some different event. I don't know if they'll bring it back since they want you to get her signature. Ooh, who's this guy? Well, we have another person for you. will be the last thing you see. I love this. They declare me guilty. Yet their sin is greater. I want to see the sword. <laughs> They've fallen too far for their lofty Sienjo ships. Love the spider lilies. Oh my god, we're like halfway through now. Okay, so next though. <laughs> this is his boyfriend, isn't it? This is his boyfriend. Who said that earlier? This is totally his boyfriend. <laughs> Until your sin is cleansed, my vengeance will pursue you. Dude, this trailer was epic. What the heck? Okay, guys. It's Kafka's turn. He just had a rerun too? What is wrong? I came in the worst time. Okay, here, guys. Here we go. This is who you've been waiting for. Stick to the plan, shoot on sight! I repeat, shoot on sight! <laughs> Don't be afraid. Listen to me. Wasn't it you? Who invited me? Oh, I'm getting chills.
The silk is too fragile to be a threat. Unless you're more fragile than the silk. Case in point. She can leave me a bit dumb She can tuck you in. So I'm stealing a glass, right? And Barbara de Rune, Me doing so of the immediately. Dragon, commander of the clouds and the rain. Tasked with watching over the ambrosial arbor. Okay, we got Don Hung, but like Embibitor Im and Rune. Arcanum. Guilty of unpardonable sins. Punishable by death. Who is this? The consequences are mine to bear. Fantilia, if you wish to obstruct me, you'll have to do better. You're flawed. Damn. This one's... he's much cooler. This is a much cooler version of it. Celestial Dragon, break. So... You now presume redemption is within your grasp. I stand here to fight for a new life. Delve hidden moon, world cleansing dragon. Do you really think you have a choice this time? Yeah. Who's this? We haven't seen her yet. <gasps> we can see them all on one go now. Fallen petals bed the ground. All is preordained. Ooh, she's cute. Through the omniscia is destined to be realized. Now that all elements of the past have taken their places, <laughs> the future sits within my reach. Many morphed to one. Nova burst. Shunned by hearts. Oh, I like her. The omnisia sees through you. The cycles of yin and yang never cease. Nope, like that girl. <laughs> She's so good and also a little strong. Delving into the way of the world, scrutinizing the universe's entirety. It's me, like, let's go. Though all things in the universe have their own inherent principles, the choice between real and woe lies in our own hands. She's a long ass trailer. Be vigilant of three things. Fire, theft, and teammates. Although the general's comments are crude, they're nonetheless logical. King Shui, your thoughts? <laughs> <laughs> the Sienjo has met with countless trials. The darkening mists shroud the radiant moon. 
Who are you? Bound by blindness, one is cast into Mara with a sharp blade. Another mother? Yet still powerless against the demons. Oh, with this voice. as my core, the inner self is purged. Try to cleanse it. Remnants of the past return with the snow. Powerless. Unable to mend past animosity. This is so cool. I will never forsake. Topaz and Nummy? Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Topaz from the special Dead Marshal Force. The further you run, the bigger it gets. So give up the chase and pay up the debts. Still not following? Then why not learn from the pros? One, balancing the books is a moral imperative. Default and pay double. Two, shed any oh, and so all cute. illusions of outwitting the system. I like her book. Why is it Miss Topaz? What a delightful surprise! <laughs> Hold it. <laughs> Beware gifts. They can veil ulterior <laughs> motives. <laughs> Three, in negotiations, choose ability over familiarity. Madam Herda, your account has been These character frozen. designs are so good. This I want to get my OC Honkai. Bill. Same! I want to be- I want to be Honkai Star See here, Miss Asta? She could collect my tags if I need it. Bags. Four. In business, there are no permanent enemies. Looks like they've run into trouble. All right, Nummy, you're up! You've got cute Nummies, too! Making friends can be beneficial to both parties. Wouldn't you agree, Supreme Guardian? Wait, is this who I've been waiting for? Is this a dude or...? That's all for today. Stonks. Is this the dude? We stand against <laughs> ill repute. Is this the guy with the vest that doesn't close properly? We champion our or is this a different guy? Blindly. Long no, this is a different guy. Let's go. The beauty is universal. She is within our grasp and beyond the expanse of the cosmos. Our genti of the honor clad swears to you. The beauty is eternal. Knights of beauty? Are they that amazing? Oh. Legend tells of a lone beast deep in the stars called the Omen of Evil. Hey, it has scales tough as armor. Wait, who's the guy that Many has his like powerful, but it has the a vest nice that's like lodged in its bones. On the land at the end. You won't get a trail. Oh, damn. But he's so cool. Too. It seems that you also have the qualifications yeah, of a knight. Okay, okay. But forgive me. For here, we must part ways. It is my fate to cross the stars alone. What a pretty boy. My faith is unbreakable. The darkness ends here. I vow to make the beauty echo throughout the universe. Till I draw my last breath. For a driller. 
Ew, there's bugs in this game. Until I see that light once more, I shall protect beauty everywhere. See you again somewhere in the universe. <laughs> so, what was he doing here again? <laughs> March. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, she's so cute. Wait, this is the ghosty. <gasps> I need her. She's cute. Ghost, ghost, ghost. What ghost? Does her tail talk? You scared me. Oh my god, it is her tail. Oh, he's like pushing her. Dude, she's cute. She has a pal sphere. Oh my god, she does. Joyous mood does it bring. A chilly wake from rest. A plum blossom in a mess. Where is the home I miss? You can totally see like how much better this the trailers have gotten, like from March to this oh. one. Oh, I watched it because that's how Chrono was like, you need to watch this trailer and then play this game. It's cute, you'll see. Will always wither. A never ending cycle of melodies. The core of all existence is unity. Oh my god, look at these. Oh, they were fine. Oh no, they didn't. <laughs> Sometimes waiting around is also a change. Oh, we got Dr. Ratio coming up at you. What the? What the? What in the space station? What was that? And the bugs are back. Huh? The results are beyond my expectations. Every petal in life's garden will meet a day when it is torn away by the wind's call. Fret not. You still hold academic value. Don't she kind of scary. Here we go, Dr. Ratio, let's go. It's so Knowledge cool. is as vast as the universe itself. And within the Intelligentsia Guild, there is a figure. Exceptional. Maverick. Wait, what? Luminary. Whose every action radiates a quiet grandeur. Ignorance is a malady that must be cured. I am Veritas Ratio, a scholar and educator. Should your mind exhibit symptoms of dullness, I love him even more. Feels free Ellie, you to have to play so you can log in and get him from the mail. You learn to know yourself before your enemy but it can still require encouragement zero points zero points next 
Is that all? I also think I love him even more because he sounds like Sebastian from Black Butler. <laughs> Not bad. Five points. <laughs> Copying others rarely leads to improved results. Just slap him with your butt. Let's what was that bathtub knowledge. scene though, guys? Like, what? Why was he just chilling in the bathtub? No need to rush. Patience breeds success. Just as my calculations predicted. Oh my god, I love An interesting him. test of intellect. <laughs> Should see his light cone. <gasps> I don't have that yet. Oh, this is another mommy, isn't it? It was kind of scary. What the heck? <laughs> what are you afraid of? Oh, is of? it? Relax. This is just a dreamscape. Life is a winding labyrinth. With memories, I like this girl too. People believe they're facing the present and the future. She they might realize we're all moving right. toward the past. Memories are different. There's more than one destiny to choose from. The road ahead is visible. Open your eyes and face your fears how else will you find the answer i love the music too there might be death insanely good combo or another time to pay don't tell me i just missed her banner but fear not unless i erase them you won't forget and now we have the one and only Sparkle. Let's go. Jinx girl, Jinxy. Jinx, Jinx. So what? Let me tell you what foolishness is. Yeah, I think this is like my favorite trailer. Pretending to be smart like you do. Then, what is a fool? Knowing when to act clueless. Like I do. <laughs> Isn't it cool? What is elation? Me. Freaking out in the chat right now. <laughs> like, I especially love when it like starts picking up. Wait, I have to go back to it because I just find it so cool. I'm actually dying. Isn't it? Yeah, so this is what like Chrono sent me to like get me to watch. Where is it? It's like over here. Get it now? What is elation? 
Sparkles trailer is my favorite. I mean, Dr. Ratio is in a bathtub, but like, that was like watching a music video or something. Okay, Elle, you have nine, like 16 days to go polar and play this in the dark <laughs> arcade. Wait, is it back? Just now? Wait, is the arcade back with all the, like, all the screens and stuff or whatever? Okay, wait, let me. Go back to just chatting and close that and bring this over here and play this music because holy, I have to go eat and use the bathroom so badly. <laughs> um, damn, we've been streaming for so long, four and a half hours. Sorry, I wanted to watch all those, so. Um, yeah, oh my goodness, there's so many people streaming right now. What the heck? Oh God. Oh, yeah, I can't wait for the, tra the other trailers that are coming out. Eee! Oh wait, no, the world where the entire room is the video player. Yeah, 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 that one. Oh my goodness, I think my tracking's all fucked now too. You think Rachel washes that shirt in the bed? <laughs> yes, yes they do. Okay, I'm just seeing who I should go right right now. Um, um, um. Yeah, thanks you guys. Thank you guys for chilling. That was a fucking epic story, like uh, finishing out Bailabog, and then. I need to go get that song that was in that fight because that was fucking epic. And then, um, and then, yeah, all those trailers were fucking sick. So, well, maybe the beginning ones were mid, like March's was mid, but you could tell like over time that they made them way more like cinematic masterpieces. So yeah, it was fun. Yeah, getting through part one. How many parts are there even? Yeah, yeah, you gotta go watch back, watch the VOD. Uh, it's, it, Give me a second on it, because I don't have them published right away, just because I like to download them um, before they get like muted or whatever, if they get muted. So if you don't see it right away, don't worry. It'll it'll be up like at least 30 minutes after like I like I do this all right after I get off stream. So um, I'm sorry, I'm just trying to think like, who do I want to go send us to right now? Oh my God, ew, it's doing that thing. How do I, viewers, how do I, okay. Oh, Koyo's, streaming again too was she streaming oh my god i'm going to koyo she's playing she's playing oh my goodness yeah i probably have like a lot yeah how many worlds are there out so far or are they not like done by worlds i guess we're on planet three right now oh like that's what that's what's currently out okay okay i'm gonna take us on over to i think koyo is who we rated last time i'm gonna i'm gonna rate her again just because she's playing this fucking game called pumpkin panic and i played it on stream like a while ago where you're like this pumpkin man and like do you guys remember that game whoever was there to watch it it was like you're a little pumpkin man and you plant you have to get you have to get off this boat but like these horrors and stuff like run at you in the night and stuff and it's like super fucking terrifying so I'm gonna take us on over here because I'm gonna make food and probably just chill there and see how she reacts to it so <laughs> so let me go hit her with the raid um yeah I don't uh what day is it tomorrow Thursday um I know Khan, Yumi, Elle, and Kibbs are gonna play, but that'll be in the evening. So I may stream tomorrow after work for like two hours, like a shorter stream, um, but we'll see. If I don't, then then I don't, so. <laughs> but yeah, um, yeah, yeah, she's playing that game, so I wanna go see. I don't know how far she is or how many times she's died, but I can't tell because it's like pitch black in the game right now, but yeah. But yeah, I will tweet when I go live. Um, stream phasma instead oh my god i'd be so bad at it and probably be screaming at each other too so yeah i'll definitely be in the evening sometime so and probably not this late like it's fucking late now so but yeah i will talk to you guys all later uh thank you for the follows and the subs and everything and all that jazz and for chilling with me through here it was a lot of fun i will catch you guys on the next stream bye